Today we're doing some. Oh, <gasps> Mega Dimension Neptonia. Uh, I said V two, right? V two. Woohoo! Definitely not seven. It's V two. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I just defeated the big monster thing, like up there. Our first giant battle it was interesting. And uh, I didn't go here because I was like, eh, there's going to be story stuff when I go over here. Oh, wait, it was up here, actually. Wasn't it? Yeah, it was up there. Where we did the giant battle. Let's try going here. Ooh. If it's right. a fight, then go ahead and I'll work hard to become a fully fledged CPU. Sure, 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 you will. Pudding, Philia. Pudding! Pudding! You have anything new in here? Is it an improvement, though? That might be what I already have. Bamboo sword. Yeah, I already bought bought those. What is development then? Oh yeah, that's basically item plans now, right? A little bit different because uh, making item plans in the previous games, you just did from like, you just did from uh, this menu. There's like plans somewhere in here. Now it's tied to town. Which is interesting. Apparently shops can have their own unique items. Which is also interesting. Hmm. I bet you're the same hint before. Yeah, you can check help topics. Blah, 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 blah. Umio, the, 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 the handsome sounding fish monster, right? Everyone was like, ooh, he sounds so handsome. And then he, they saw him and they were like, oh, that's, that's a fish. You're sleepy, but have no points. Why you been spending all your points? Oh my gosh. I can't believe this. You could just um, get your slate. And lurk so you get points. Apple taste. Let's toast our to our victory. Let's do it. I knew there wasn't gonna be voice acting. I knew it. I wasn't sure what was gonna happen for a moment there, but I'm glad we won. Me too. But I wonder why we were suddenly able to gather shares. Um well, yeah, they were, weren't they? Hmm. Because all the, um... Dogus, right? Dogus. Well, how do you pronounce it? Believed in you. Or something. Isn't it only possible to acquire shares from humans? Not anymore, bitch. Allow me to explain. Before that, however, where is Uzume? Uzume went up to the rooftop so she could take a shower first. Ah, then this is most opportune. I wouldn't want Uzume to overhear what I'm about to disclose. Uh-oh. What do you mean? Uzume possesses a certain special ability. Special ability? She's able to turn her daydreams into reality. I'm a BRB, I'm a daydream about chocolate ice cream. Let's do it. Those sound like my streamer. Yeah, toast. So that would mean she has the ability to intervene in real world events. Yes. But is it possible to do such a thing? You cannot interfere or change large scale events, but she does possess this power. 
You two have some experience with convenient things occurring exactly the way she had imagined, do you not? Oh. When she goes into like that, I'm so cute, see my way mode, then, uh, then she actually makes it happen. That's interesting. As long as what she ever she daydreams isn't too large scale. You can't be like, oh, it'd be so cool if, um, you know, uh, every disease disappeared from the world at the same time or whatever. Can't, can't do that. Too large scale. Oh, could you mean the pudding ingredients? Wait, really? Do you think she just made them exist? What? Correct. She imagined and wished for you two to create and eat pudding. This is why you were able to find ingredients. She also imagined and wished today, during our battle. She wished you three would be able to obtain shares from monsters and subsequently transform. That's why we were able to gain shares all of a sudden. Oh, I thought it was going to be like, it's a different dimension so the rules are different. So it doesn't have to be humans, but okay. You could have just come up with whatever, but, you know. All right. This way it's more creative. That's amazing! It's like a super cheat code! Wait, why hasn't she used such a convenient ability before? If she did, couldn't she have beaten the giant already? There are certain things that come into play, such as the fact that Uzume cannot bring something into existence unless she sincerely imagines it. That is to say that how she manipulates reality is also based on her subconscious. This is why I'm extremely grateful to you both. You helped Usume change the state of shares within this world. I can only hope that if we are not too late, we will be able to stop this world's collapse. I get it, Umio. That's why you said something to lead her on at the time. I'm surprised you noticed. I guess you could say it was by chance. You were actually engaging in Uzume's story for once, so it kind of got me curious. Now that you understand her ability, I sincerely ask that you please keep it a secret from her. How does she not know about her own ability, though? Like, come on. How, how, how does she not know about her own ability? It's finally over. That's right. It's finally over. That's right. We reached the end game credits. It's over, right? Yeah, sure. We're not like... Uh, I wasn't reading everything out loud or whatever. We were like, we were like uh, an hour into the game if you were just zipping through it. Right. There don't seem to be chapters like there were in the previous games. But this is probably chapter one. Come on now. Chapter two uh, tops. Come on now. Come on now, it's early game. Hey, Yuzume, can I talk to you for a second? Hmm? What's up, Nepsy? I was just wondering what you're planning on doing next. Oh, you mean about that, huh? I'm gonna go beat the shit out of that purple hag, of course. Damn. Or R4. Being called a purple hag. Come on now. Well, I'm sure she's no match for a giant killer like me. Damn, she's uh, she's gotten pretty cocky. Okay, so once you take out R4, what's after that? After that? Oh, that's what you mean. You know what I'm getting at? You want me to come with you, right? Back to your world? That's right. Ooh, you're good, Izume. We're becoming completely telepathic with each other. Your offer makes me really happy, Nepsy. But... And I know that it's probably a great place. It's your nation, after all. But, I'm sorry. I can't go with you. Hi! 
there's no one here anymore. What if we could be even be CPU partners? I mean, if they save the world, maybe all the people will just magically poof back to existence. It said they disappeared, right? So disappeared doesn't necessarily mean die. They could have said disappeared as like the softer way to say they died, but maybe they actually meant disappeared and they'll just be like, poof. And it'll be like nothing bad ever happened, right? We got the sad music going though. I know for a fact that people of my nation would love you in a heartbeat. Well, Nepsy, I've spoken with everyone a while ago about the possibility of leaving this world and searching for a new one to live in. But the answer was unanimous. Even if it was possible to leave, no one wanted to cast away this world. <clears throat> this world, even if it, even in its brokenness. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. World. We decided we'd struggle here in this world till until the very end. Uh. Well, let me get this straight. Someone shows up and is like, hey, you don't have to suffer anymore. You're like, nah, bitch, let me suffer. I'm gonna take care of my own world. And the punchline was that after investigating, we found this world's civilization isn't advanced enough for dimensional travel. How are we getting back home then? Musume! Ah, come on, don't give me that gloomy look. This isn't permanent, you know. We'll see each other again, right? Uh, at my doubts. That purple hag might be behind this world's destruction. And if I defeat her, maybe it'll return to normal. If that's the case, I'll revive this city and the entire nation along with it. I'll be starting from zero. Or, I guess it's more like starting from the negative, but I'm going to make this nation amazing. Once all that happens, I'll have to come by and visit your nation. Wait, once she- once they- uh, so she wants to... Save the nation, build it up to the point where it can have dimensional travel, and then come visit. Okay. And, uh, uh, okay. But isn't being by yourself lonely? Doesn't it make you feel helpless? Uh-oh. I got Umio, the baby bugs, and all my doggoo friends, too. It's pretty lively as it is, really. Musume. So, that's it. If you keep being a lazy ass and eating all that pudding, our nation's gonna pass yours up in no time. Oof. Yeah. I think I want a population of a hundred thousand. Maybe even a whole million. All throughout the city will have elevators, moving walkways, and cars without any wheels flying through big glass tubes. Uh-oh. 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 And all the citizens will wear tights all the time. Uh, actually, that's lame. Forget I said that. This is the era of infotech. I'll establish a culture surrounding the World Wide Web and make it so people can play games online. Play games? Online? No way. That sounds too unrealistic. When you're online, you'll be able to complete in- Or not- Wait, complete? Oh. Wouldn't it be compete? I mean... I'm pretty sure it does say complete. But, uh, but if you read the sentence... Uh, I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be compete. Not complete. Compete. Get that extra L out of my word. Get my extra L out of there. F12, man. This makes for like the fourth typo I've seen. First one today. I saw like three last room. It's hard to catch all the words, obviously. This one wouldn't even uh, it have been uh, caught by, like, a misspelling thing, because complete's a word, so... This one you only find by actually reading it. Not terrible. 
When you're online, you'll be able to compete in fighting or racing games with other people, or adventure in RPGs together. I really hope... No, I'm gonna do it. I'll create that fun, wonderful nation. Wouldn't it be the coolest thing ever? Definitely! I think it'd be super cool. When I first woke up here, you know, that was the first thing I tried to do. But at the time, nobody would follow me. Umio told me I wasn't going to be ready to make it happen for another 10 years. Oh, I totally understand. I get that a lot, too. You know, Nepsy, I don't think it's a bad thing to pursue the dreams you have. It's way better than just settling. Besides, it's fun to imagine all your crazy dreams coming to life. I really hope you can make it happen, Uzume. It will, Nepsy. I will make it a reality. Aww. Oh. We're back to Nep's station. You know what time it is. It's Nep station time. It's your newscaster out of here. Your hosts today are Neptune and... Nepgear, reporting live. So, Nepgear, never thought we'd be able to transform, huh? Indeed. What was even more surprising was that it was due to Uzume's ability. I didn't expect our first HDD battle to be against that giant, either. Wow! Speaking of unexpected, that one person showed up again. What's up with that, right? Um... Um... um I mean... R4 has been in, like, every game, so... Oh, right! R4, belt conveyor, or some such named eggplant color person, right? What? Okay. Uh, eggplants. Eggplants. Neptune, you're really doing that on purpose, aren't you? Well, eggplant lady's just a foil at this point, so let's forget her and move on to the episode preview. Take it away, Nepgear! A new enemy targeting us stands in Uzume's path as she searches for a way to send us home. Countless monsters attack. Neptune finally activates that forbidden system. Next episode, give you strength. Today's... Wait, that's Neptune. Today's preview still kind of wasn't a preview, but don't worry about it. We're working out the kinks. We'll see you next time. What? I thought I was going to get quizzed this time. This VA idea idea hundred idea factory should hire. Oh, let's rot, let's rot. Blah. Look. What, what's going on now? Hey, here are you two. How long do you plan on dawdling about? You're too much too young to be loafing around all day. But Humio, all this exhaustion from fighting the giant won't go away. Oh no. Me too. I just can't get motivated. Dear me, where has all that spirit you both had before gone? <sighs> They're tired. They haven't had pudding. Uh, I'm sorry. Even my sister's giving you trouble now. No need to apologize. I suppose their lack of energy now is a direct effect of a demanding bout with that giant. Besides, all we have are endless days of work once we get back home. So we won't get punished for taking it easy here. Oh, this is the real reason. This is the truth. N Neptune. She's like, damn. Then, Gearsy, would you mind accompanying me today? Me? I don't mind, but where are we going? Hmm, what's this? You taking her on a date, Umio? <laughs> sure. Has Neptune here finally entered her popular phase? As her older sister, this means I'll have to interrogate every one of her suitors to make sure they're wholesome. Okay. All right, Nepsy, it's decided. Let's shadow them on their date. Uh, it's definitely not a date. Huh? I is this what I... 
Is that... Wait. Wait. Huh? What is this sentence? Is this what this... What? What the fuck does this sentence mean? I thought it was... My, my autopilot was gonna say, Is this what I think it is? Or something like that is what my autopilot was gonna do. And I was like, wait a minute, that's not what this sentence says. I have no idea what this sentence says. Is this what this is? Huh? I, I think it's definitely supposed to be, is this what I think this is? F12? Uh, this one's not a typo like some of the other misspellings I've seen. This one's just a grammatical what the fuck. Oh, we're gonna make up our own. Huh? Is this what it's, I think this is? There we go. There we go. <laughs> you're quite adorable when you're flustered, Kersey. <laughs> That's not gonna help these guys thinking it's not a date. Unfortunately, this will not be something so fanciful. I came upon an interesting facility while taking a stroll last night. I suspect there may be data there that might interest you. Thus, the invitation. Oh, like more diaries? Uh, oh, I understand. I was a little startled. Perhaps you should have preferred, ne or you would have preferred Neptune's assumed intention. <laughs> Goodness, please don't tease me. <laughs> I apologize. Well, that is my proposed idea. Nepsi, Uzume, what will you do? I wouldn't mind if you both came along as well. Hmm, there's nothing for me to do even if I hang out here. So I guess I'll tag along. Nepsy, what about you? If Uzume is cruising, then I will too. It'd be boring if I stayed here all alone. Fantastic. Then, let us depart. Oh, what are we gonna do? I'm tired. Oh, next part. Now then, everyone, please look at this facility. Huh, I never knew this place existed in the city. What's up with this equipment? Does it work? I, too, was quite surprised when I discovered it. I never would have imagined a facility like this would be left standing in such pristine condition. Umio, is it alright if I take a look around? He's like, yes. I haven't the slightest idea, or I, I haven't the slightest about what sort of facility this is. But I'm sure no one is around who would protest. Yay, in that case, I'll get started on digging around this main computer and its server. First, I'll connect the end gear by wire. There. How's it, sweet sis of mine? Find anything interesting? She's like concentrating. Hmm. Yo, zero dimension to Nep Jr. On stride and just she's absorbed in her her work here. Psh, no way! Is my own younger sibling giving me the cold shoulder? It seems Gearsy is extremely focused at the moment, so it may be her be may be best to keep from disturbing her at the moment. At the moment. At the moment. At the moment. Oh, could this possibly be? What is it? A discovery? Did you find something cool? Yes, I thought this was some sort of communication facility. But I think... My, but I think might actually... But I think it... F12. Where's all, why is all my typos popping up now? I've seen like three grammatical errors. I saw three grammatical errors like... Or some misspellings or something. I think one of them was misspelling. Like last stream. But I've already seen three this stream. We're speed running them now. What I think this might actually be, but I think it might actually be whatever. This would fit better though, since they used this earlier in the sentence. But, uh, but I think this might actually be for transportation. A transport facility, you say? Oh, but the equipment here is only enough for transport between here and neighboring cities. And this is conjecture, conjecture, but from examining this device, interdimensional travel seems unlikely with the limited science tech here. Ah, that would happen. Sorry, I didn't mean to get your hopes up. It's alright, little sis. You're trying. 
We just have to keep searching. Phone call. Hmm? What's that noise? Huh? That's my end gear's ringtone. But I don't have reception at all, so... I guess you do. A call? From who? Um... Oh my goodness! It's Eastwar! Neptune, I'm getting a call from Eastwar! Really? Wow, she must have a premium cell phone plan to make calls between dimensions! I am. Neptune, Jr., Eastwar can be pretty impatient, so I'd pick up that call right about now if I were you. Hello, this is Nepgear. Oh, Nepgear! Oh, thank goodness. I've been dying to reach you. Is Neptune with you? Yes, she's right here with me. Howdy, Esty! It's been a doggo's age. How you been? I'm relieved to hear both of your voices. I've been incredibly worried since your sudden disappearance. Oh, it is there the same East War this time? Last game there were like two East Wars, so it was like, is this the same one? Is this is this our East War? Or is this the other one? It seems to be their East War. I'm sorry, Isty. We tried so many times to contact you. There is no reason for you to apologize, Nepgear. After all, you two are in another dimension. Yes. She's like, wait, wait, I was right. Um, Nepgear. Can you hear me? I just said you're in another dimension. Does that not surprise you? Huh? What are you implying? I just confirmed that you are in another dimension, yes? I assumed you would be more shocked by this information. <laughs> naive. So very naive, Isty. We've already figured out we're in another dimension over here. How do you like that? I never would have expected Neptune to anticipate her current situation in this manner. Have you hit your head anywhere, perchance? Damn, she just basically just insulted her. She's like, wow, I wasn't expecting you to be that smart. Hey now, Isty! Isn't that kind of cruel? Yes. I haven't cracked my melon open or anything. And my brain operates at lightning speeds. Uh, no. Well, the image of you being lazy has been burned in my mind lately, so I was under the impression you only use your skull for sport. Rip. Ah, oh, so Nepsy acts the same in her world, too. Oh? Who else is there with you two? Her names are Usume and Umio. They've been helping us quite a bit. Usume also happens to be the CPU here. I see. I cannot begin to express my gratitude to you for looking after these two. Don't worry about it. I haven't had this much fun in as long as I can remember. It's been a blast having them around. He's like, what? You're not, you're not admonishing them for, for their laziness? What? What the fuck is a dog who's age? Hmm... Well, a doggo is an enemy type in this world. Well, actually, in their world. Doggos are friendly in this world. How? What a doggo's age is, though. Fuck if I know. I don't know. Like, maybe how long a doggo lives? I don't know. Who knows? Pro probably at least five minutes. Probably a minimum of at least five minutes. What's wrong? Something I said? Oh, no. Nothing at all. I apologize. You reminded me of an old acquaintance. R please, pay it no mind. That's right. I have not yet introduced myself. My name is Istoire, and I am currently operating as Planeptune's Oracle. Istoire and Planeptune, huh? Oh dear, what's the matter? Are you not feeling well? But, nah, my bad. It's nothing. Just a little tired. Sorry to make you worry. 
Fuzume, would you allow me to speak with her as well? Oh, right. Of course. Greetings, Histoire. This is Umio. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. The pleasure is mine, Umio. I apologize for any trouble the girls have caused. Neptune in particular. No apologies necessary, Histoire. It's felt quite lonesome here for some time now. This excitement has been perfect for us. Oh, it truly is a relief to hear that. Why does this conversation sound like two parents talking to each other? Yeah, what are we, kids or something? Um, yeah, kinda. You are like a daughter to me, Uzume. What? How is your kid, Umio? Banging head against wall. Why are they so stupid? Agus or Slime on Nep World. Yeah, they're enemies on Nep's, Nep's World. They're uh, friendly monsters here. Game industry is right. Mr. Umio, you are the father. What a shocking revelation for Umio the Merman, folks. Huzume, how's it feel to be this nation's first mer CPU? Uh... Then doesn't that mean I can breathe underwater? And it means I have a right to eat as much shrimp and crab as I want. Alright. We can have a decadent crab hot pot tonight. Woohoo! I had simply meant that as a metaphor. Like, oh uh, god. It would appear your hands are quite full. I do offer my sympathies, Umio. Hey, Histoire, are you going to be able to help us find the way back home? I don't see any possibility here for interdimensional travel. Please, rest assured. I med- Might not meditating. By mediating through the end gear and linking a transport terminal from that world to a transport tor terminal in ours, it is possible for me to transfer both of you. Ooh, just as expected of my ISTI. I'm proud to see you suddenly becoming so amazingly high spec. However, this will co consequently deplete a large amount of share energy from our world, so please understand that. If we can make it back home, then that's all small stuff. Nep Jr. will work hard for our shares when we get back after all. Not you, though? Only me? Oh, that right. Don't be ridiculous. Gaining share energy is in your job description as well, Neptune. When you return, you believe me. I will have you working like a dog. Damn. Now she's not going to go back. Are you for real? Sheesh, maybe I'll just stay put on this side of the pond. Don't say that, big sis. Let's get home. I'll help out too, so let's do our best together. Okay, Neptune? You'll really help me out? All right, yippee. Heavens, you always spoil her like this, Nepgear. So, Isti, we're actually already in a facility that houses a transfer terminal. Is this true, Nepgear? Yes, but this terminal is only calibrated for spatial transfer within this dimension. Would this be compatible for our application? Yes, as long as it is indeed a transfer terminal, it will work without any problems. Okay, so I will use the transfer terminal that you are currently connected to. Yes, you two found your ride. Looks like it. I really wanted to get back home to my friends and my pudding, but now... Well, I'm feeling kind of reluctant about it. I bet you are. I want to work like a puppy dog. Me too. I knew this would be an inevitability, but I didn't think it'd be I'd be by myself again so quickly. It feels like you just got here. Oh, that's right. If we leave, she'll be all alone again. Uh-oh. Well, Nepsy, Gearsy, it's been fun. I've only known you for a few days, but it feels like it's been so much longer. You make sure to take care of yourself, Gearsy. Yes, I truly am sorry. You helped us out so much, but I couldn't figure out anything about the destruction of your world. You need not worry of it, Gearsy. 
I'll take my time to investigate the rest. Hmm? This is quite strange. It appears I cannot access that terminal over there. Wait, it might be... Histoire, please give me a moment while I check on something. Checking, checking, one, two, three, checking, checking. I knew it! This terminal is broken! God damn it! We have to stay here after all, no way. Who could have expected this? I see. This is a huge problem. If we cannot use this terminal, then I'm afraid we may be out of options. Then let me fix it! I'll have to examine it to be sure, but I don't think it's too damaged. I believe this could still work for us. Wow, I knew you were good with machines, but I'm impressed you can fix something like this. Well, she is my awesome little sister after all. By the way, what's your special skill, Nepsy? Uh, uh, uh. Or what? Gear check. I know, right? Gear check. Let's, let's check this gear here. Let's check that gear there. Me? Well, I have... Uh... Uh, uh wait! Uh, what should I do, Isame? I don't think I have any marketable skills like Nep Jr. Don't ask me. I know, right? Uh, Uzume can do that, um, uh, making things reality thing. Nep Air is good at machines. Neptune's good at sleeping and eating pudding. Please contact me once you have completed your repairs, Nepgear. I believe as long as you are within close proximity to the terminal, I can contact you through your end gear. Okay, I understand. I'll call you as soon as I'm finished. Is there any way we may be of help? For now, I'm going to try and figure out why the terminal is broken down. So you're free to do as you please for now. For now, for now, for now, for now, for now. Ah, there you go again, Nep Jr. Don't be shy. We're more than happy to help. I might not stay up to date with all the games out there, but I for sure know my way around retro consoles. Taking this apart will be a breeze. But why do we have, like, the action movement thing going on? And if I show off how awesome and cool I am here, then everyone is gonna realize just how capable of a person I really am! Four exclamation points for emphasis. It's like this problem is affecting Nepsy in her own unique way. Um, I may kind of want you to stay put, Neptune. What? Pump the brakes, Nepsy. Gearsy got Gearsy's got it handled. Let's go see if we can find anything around here that might be useful to us. Oh no! Nep Gears left. Come back. Come back, Nep Gear. Come back. Are the repairs done yet? Gear, how's it looking? Think it's gonna work? Ooh, so that's how it's wired. That's pretty strange. I wonder why they have those pots mounted on the board as opposed to... One hour later. Hey, Gearsy. You done yet? I see. So these broken sold... So so isn't it sp found solder? Like soldering iron? These broken solder joints were probably causing it to short out. I wonder where this resistor was supposed to go. Three hours later. <laughs> I can't eat any more. Wowie, this is so crazy. The circuit board has GC1988 printed on it. An 88 circuit board is super rare! Ooh, this circuit doesn't really serve any purpose for our application, so I can just bypass it and take the board home with me. 
<laughs> is she, is she, uh, she's stealing stuff. Five hours later. <laughs> it's finished. What? Oh. It's finally done. We've been waiting. Yeah, yeah, they have. So, will the transfer terminal work? Well, I fixed as much as I could, but there are two problems. Problems? Yes, the corrosion of one of the core parts of this terminal is really bad. If we want to use the terminal, we need to replace that part. I was able to patch up a lot of the other problems, but... Well, I still have a long way to go. You're doing great, Gearzy. What's the other problem? We have no power. A large amount of energy is required to get the terminal running, but there barely seems to be any power left in this building. I see. Both are difficult problems. Nah, we can at least search for the spare part. This city's so vast, I'm sure we can find a substitute for it. And what of the energy? We can likely find a replacement part quite easily. But I imagine finding a power source being difficult. We can figure that part out later. I re can't really think of where we'd even find that right now. Yep, we might find a solution while we're looking for the part. Exactly. That being said, let's go look for it. Nepgear's back! Yes! That's right! Best ability, Nep... Ne wait, Nep... Nep Sab's putting hunger. But how does that ability help anybody? This helps her. Get pudding. Just to send on a PC. Hmm. Uh, Nepgear was fixing a like an old PC. Like you pick up like a, a like one of those big boxy PCs that had like the big monitors. She's basically repairing one of those. I'm getting kind of hungry. I can't find anything. I could have sworn I saw something that looked similar. Let's take a break for lunch. We can keep searching after. I'm starving. I like that idea. What should we do for lunch? I know. Let's have some pudding. You know what's really interesting to me? Is Neptune was really big on pudding in the first game, Rebirth 1 or whatever. I didn't play, I haven't played the PS3 ones, but she was really big on pudding in Rebirth 1. But in Rebirth 2, that pretty much disappeared entirely. There was pretty much no pudding jokes at all in Rebirth 2. And in Rebirth 3, the pudding jokes come back somewhat, but the pudding jokes are just... Like, popping up so much more often in this game. It's more like Rebirth 1 with all the pudding jokes. It's very interesting. It's like, oh, they remembered her quirk from Rebirth 1? Okay. They remembered it come Rebirth 3, and then they were like, let's just let's just di turn up the dial to like 200% for this game. It is around that time, now that you mention it. Is there anything you're craving, Uzume? Pudding, Nepsy? It's gotta be meat. How can you have any pudding if you don't eat your meat? I wonder what this could be referencing. I don't know. No idea. Definitely haven't seen any thing or a meme or joke or about... No, never. Neptune? How does meat sound? Wait, like meat pudding? That sounds awful. What the fuck? What? Meat's good too, but I'd still like to propose having some super sugar treats as a dual lunch snack time meal. Oh, meat with pudding. Okay. I thought for a second. Uh oh, she's uh oh, she's dreaming it. What's gonna happen though? I thought for a second she was like talking about meat flavored pudding, and I was about to be like. Well, I guess sweets sound good too. But when you talk about sweets, it's gotta be crepes. I think you pronounce that like that. 
Fuzume would so love to have a strawberry chocolate banana crepe with, like, a ton of whipped cream. The balance between the tangy, slightly sour strawberry and the sweet chocolate is super yummy. It's just the best. That's right. Oh, even if we had the ingredients, it'd be so totally awesome if we had that. He's like, uh-oh. It's gonna happen now. <coughs> well, you know, meat's good and all, but I'm not really that hungry anyway. Whatever's clever, Nepsy. Dear me, there's no reason to even cover it up at this point. And it's decided we'll have crepes for lunch. Let's search around for any leftover ingredients. There's a building nearby that looks like it used to be a market. Let's check it out. Musume is really cute when she tries acting all tough. It's so adorable. <laughs> I'd really like to take her to the crepe shop on Planet Tower Street someday. Hmm? That terminal over there. Oh, this terminal might be... I knew it! This terminal can get online. I might be able to find something. I'm up for another diary. Ah, here it is. X month, X day. We can't stop. X is rampaging. X is... What is that? Something, whatever. At this rate, Redacted will fall to ruins. I decided to search for a way to stop her rampage. Redacted month, Redacted day. I feel like I'm seeing a Redacted. Yet another Redacted has perished. How could I possibly stop it? X month, X day. I'm sure we could just put in whatever. Pudding, return to normal. There we go. That's totally right. She remembered what she had done. Pudding asked me to pudding her. Oh my god. That kill her? Wait, so wait. So wait. There's like CPUs going rampaging. They're like losing control of their powers or something. And whoever it is asked me to. To unalive! Hmm. I get... Of so I get... I sort of get the meeting. Meeting, 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 meeting. Really? I sort of get the meaning, but at the same time, I sort of don't. I kind of get the meaning better than you do. I think, anyway. What are you looking at? Oh, Musume. Um, I'm collecting intel on what happened here in your world, and... Wait, didn't I mention this before? Oh, right. My bad. I wonder if this means that Uzume was rampaging and, uh... She lost her memories, right? So... Maybe she, like, collapsed or whatever, lost her memories, woke up being like, huh, what? So, how's that going? I found several records, but all the data I've found so far is incredibly disjointed. I can't make heads or tails of what I've read. What's your end goal here, Gearsy? I just want to know the truth. I want to know what this world was like and why it's been destroyed. It's just speculation, but I feel like the reason this nation fell into ruin is written here in these records. There might not be much I can actually do with that information once I uncover it. But even so, it'll just be good to know. I see. Maybe you'll be the one to release me from this prison, Gersey. What? Prison? I've tried so many times to escape. Every attempt has been in vain. That blue sky feels so nostalgic. You might be just what I needed. Usume? Wait, what is she talking about? Does she remember stuff? What? Whoops. That's not how you spell whoops, right? I've never seen whoops without the H before. What the fuck? Ah! Whoopsie. Whoops, I started talking about weird things. Forget it. I'll catch up with you later. Prison, huh? Maybe it really is painful for Uzume to be in this world. Maybe she was remembering stuff for a second there. Hey, Gearsy. Wake up, Gearsy. Hmm? Huh? Why are you here, Uzume? I thought you just walked away. Wait, what? Man, still half asleep? Wait, was she dreaming that? 
I came over here saying there might be a terminal connected to the web and didn't come back, so I came to pick you up. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, yes, I guess that was what happened. What? So, find anything? Oh, I did. I was able to find this record. Let me see. Redacted month, redacted day. I can't stop Redacted's rampaging powers. I mean, that could be Uzume. That's the right amount of squares. So maybe there was something that. I mean, it's not been the. It's not the first time that we've had like mind controlling CPUs. That was in Rebirth too. I remember. Maybe uh, they like mind controlled Uzume. She went crazy. Went on a rampage. Collapsed. Lost her memories. Woke up and was like, huh. It's my theory anyway. No, 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 no we'll, we'll figure it out. So we'll, we'll get to the bottom of this mystery. At this rate, the world will fall into fall to ruins. I decided to search for a way to stop her rampage. Redacted month, redacted day. I feel like I'm seeing a nightmare. Yet another city has perished. How can I possibly stop it? Redacted month, redacted day. Redacted, return to normal. She remembered what she had done. Wait, some of this isn't redacted. Kill Kill was redacted when uh, Nepgear read it. Not anymore, though. You remembered what she had done. Redacted asked me to kill her. What the hell is this? I don't get it at all. Kirzy, does this make sense to you? Huh? I feel like it looks different from before. But I can see the data properly. Was I that half asleep? I have the feeling they weren't. There's just something going on. Hey, Nepsy! I found this in a pile of rubble. Here you go. Hello! Is this a dead copy of Xabius? Huh? A what? A what's a what? You know of it? Know it? It's a super famous title where the makers of the original placed a hidden message that easily weeds out the fake ones. Ah. Huh? You're pretty knowledgeable when it comes to games, huh, Nepsy? And over here is a Benta! If you peel off this crappy logo sticker... See? Told ya! It says Zeka! The real manufacturer behind this thing! I should show this to Nep Jr. too! Hey! Nep Jr! We found something rare! Hey! Nep Jr! Sorting through some trash. They're gonna find E.T. somewhere. Uzume and Neptune seem to be having so much fun. But this will all end soon, won't it? Mmm. No. Is it really okay for us to leave Uzume and go back home? But Neptune and I both have to return. We have people waiting on us. They found a Dreamcast. That's what the console that they uh, pressed that transported them here looked like. It was just like an orange Dreamcast. It's like, that's totally a Dreamcast. Come on now. Who's is the Dreamcast girl, okay? And be like, what the fuck's a Dreamcast? You know, it's that console back when Sega actually made consoles. Ancient technology. I wonder what's wrong. Can she not hear me? Wait, what? Oh, right. Nepgear was thinking, so she was absorbed in thought. But she didn't hear him. Alright then, let's cheer up Nepgear! She's like, she's thinking. Just the thinking. Hey, Nepsy, isn't Gearsy acting a little weird lately? You noticed too, eh? Nepgear has an earnest soul. So if something's wrong, it's pretty much written all over her face. Is the exact opposite of you, huh? What? Are you trying to imply that I'm not earnest? 
Yep. Oof. Hi, you little... Blah. I want to defend myself, but I'm self-aware enough to know that you're right. Oh. Why don't we talk to Nepgear? Let's see what she's worrying about. Nep Jr., have a sec? Oh, Neptune. Is something the matter? You seem to be down the dumps lately, so Uzume and I were getting concerned. If something's troubling you, we'll be glad to listen. We're here for you. Troubles, huh? I'm sorry I made you both worry. It's okay, though. I'm fine. I know you better than anyone, Nepgear. You don't look fine at, at all. Oof. Yeah, Gearsy. You have a pretty awful look on your face right now. Do, do I? I should go wash my face over there for a bit. Hmm, she ran away. Still no clue about what's upsetting her. My guess is that it's difficult for her to talk to us about whatever's bumming her out so much. What could it be? Hmm, no idea, star. Okay, sure. Then let's get her something as a present to cheer her up. You'd know what to get, right? Something that Nep Jr. would like. Hmm. She is a big hardware geek, so... It'd be great if we could find something amazing enough to blow away all her worries. For example? Hmm. If there was a giant robot equipped with enough power to destroy all of civilization, she'd definitely be delighted. Is she trying to get Uzume to imagine it into reality? That sounds kind of dangerous, though. Even if that is simply an example, I'd rather stay away from something so dangerous. Uh-oh. Uzume totally thinks that something cute would be better than a giant robot. Even though I've never seen it, I'm sure Gearsy's room is full of super cute plushies. I bet she's given each and every one a proper name, and at night she sleeps while cuddling her favorite one. Then she'll come crawling into Nepsy's bed with teary eyes, saying she can't sleep without her favorite plushie. Isn't it just the most moe? Oh, I'm sure it is, so... Uh... Uh... Yeah, I'm really glad Nepgear didn't hear that. <laughs> but yeah, I think those giant robots would be pretty badass too. Gearsy would probably dig it, I guess. Robots are just the coolest after all. They're just oh so romantic. What? Or what? Huh? How is a ro how is a giant robot romantic? Clearly I know nothing of a robot. Goodness gracious, Uzume. You're always like this. I've never seen such a thing, however. Although, if one truly did exist, it'd be disturbing to have around. Games are the best answer at a time like this. No matter how troubled you are, playing games together will make all your worries fly away. Experiences over material goods. I see. It's quite like you, and a good suggestion. I can get behind that, too. Let's stop looking for parts for a little bit and go have some fun at the arcade. Huh? Where's Neptune and everyone else heading off to? Neptune, where are we going? Didn't we come here before? We're taking a break from searching for now. Let's take a breather at the arcade. Arcade? But we have to find that part. You need to loosen up, Gearsy. We've defeated the giant, so no one's going to complain if we kick it for a little bit. Right, Nepsy? Nah, we're good. If anybody has any complaints, I'll just nep them up. What does that mean? What does it mean to nep something? Destroy them. Beat them up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So, yeah, about that arcade, hmm? Usume would be super happy if they had crane games with cute plushies. And when you go to an arcade, you definitely gotta hit up the photo booths. Let's take cute photos together, Gearsy. Uh, okay.
You're right. Nap. Punch. Oh, man. We came all this way to the arcade, but all the cabinets are broken. It's no use. They won't even turn on. If they're all busted up, there's not much we can do here. Are there any other arcades? Hmm. Honestly, I haven't seen enough of the city to really know for sure, so... Umio, do you know of any arcade spots? Most arcades in this area are in similar states. In fact, out of all the places I'm aware of, this one is in the best condition. Classic Umio, so knowledgeable. I've investigated most every corner of the city in search of share crystals, after all. Going to the neighboring town might be what you guys want to do, I think. Whoa! Yikes! Why is it? Why if it isn't Baby Bug? It's been a while. What a coinky dink to meet you here. I happened to spot you all with Miss Uzume and ran over here as fast as I could. That's real nice of you, Baby Bug. It's nice to see you. So you mentioned the neighboring town. Is there an arcade there? Yeah! Some of our friends are living in a game center there. And the last time we visited, they let us play a bunch of games. Well, that's all I needed to hear. Let's head on over, everyone. We might even be able to find the parts for the transfer terminal. Whoa, we finally finished all the converse dialogue here. No way. Whoa, what? New weapons. Hmm. Turangor! How do I buy it? All right, settle. Wrongor. I'll probably I'll probably find one in a dungeon like five seconds after buying it. Wasted all my money. That happened several times before. Looks very cool. Our money. Ooh. Yeah, we'll save our money and not get those. They're not a big enough increase. The weapons probably would be pretty good. Uh, I'm still a novice, but I'll try my hardest. Wow, well, we read like 2,500 dialogues. Let's go play arcade and read 2,500 more dialogue. Oh, we're basically going all up there. What's the hidden treasure thing? I wonder. I'm sure the game will tell us at some point. The other games did have hidden treasure items, though. But... In, like, uh, the first two rebirths, there was, like, a ping thing you could do to make, like, a circle or whatever. In three, they just had boxes you jumped and hit. We haven't gotten any tutorial about hidden treasure yet, so... Let's try going here. Oh my god, is this... Gameplay?! It only took... An hour for gameplay. Over an hour, actually. Oh, this one's really narrow. I can be able to. Yeah. You were such a pain. Look 
I can be able to multi-hit guys with that Nerebi. Miss more dialogues. <laughs> Rude credit. Let's try going here. I think it should keep you progressing so you don't have to go back and reselect the thing. Far. Now, who to she could reach you though, because she's got longer range. To the You're so yeah, yeah. Looks like we win this match. Uh, can't we just hang out here? Suppose we could. Four areas again. Club Zeka. Do you like the game so far? Yeah, it's pretty cool so far. Starting off kind of similar to Rebirth 3, the last game. Get sucked into a portal. Well, here's our new friend. Oh, now we got to figure out how to get out of here. So far, it's pretty cool. Uzume is pretty cool. I can't say cute. She's trying to be cool. She's pretty cool. She's not cute. She's cool. Hey, baby bug. This is pretty different from what we were talking about. This is strange. The Hell's Crest should have been living here. I don't know what their voice is supposed to sound like. I haven't heard. I haven't heard their voice in a in a dialogue line yet, so I don't know what this green guy is supposed to sound like. We're, we're just gonna guess. Oh, Crest. What's going on? Is everyone okay? It's been rough. Dangerous monsters started living in here just a little while ago. But don't worry, everyone's safe. Thank goodness. All right, we'll deal with it. Is it okay to ask you for you for help, Miss Uzume? I'm not perfect, but I am a CPU. In situations like this, I consider it my duty to step in. When you say that monsters just settled here, you were talking about the ones outside, right? Those weaklings are no match for me. I'll get this done in style, so just watch. Thank you so much. It's all good. We heard you had some games here, and we came to play. Ain't nothing stopping us now. Ah, so that's why you and your friends came, Uzume? To play some games? As surely as I stand here. So once we defeat the monsters, can you show us the best game that's here? Of course! You ought to be having fun anyway! Koopo Cats! It could be like Rebirth 3 where there's like a translucent, almost invisible box for a hidden treasure. I think it's the ones behind the crates that I can't destroy. The... You guys. I'll be serious. I'm getting stronger. I'll end this all. Don't underestimate me. To the chest. The hurt. I wonder what level these guys are. They hurt. Oh yeah, I guess I'm supposed to rely more on formation skills. Oof. You're hurting, man. Probably supposed to rely on formation skills. Here we go. I'll leave things to you. Later. That doesn't surprise me. Oh. 
Wrong button. All right, you have to finish combos. And the first enemy in here wrecked me. I don't know if I can reach her. I can't. You must be able to do more ba damage from behind because they keep doing that. I think that was a thing in the previous games too. I'm a mess. We are a mess. Critical edge skill. Wow! Hot edge combo attack. Uh, I'm okay. I can keep going. Oh, I don't have very many life fragments. Hmm. Might want to go buy some. That was a dungeon too, right? I want to go buy items. I forgot that I used up pretty much all my life fragments with uh, the last big boss fight. Wow, I didn't get in any fights on the way over? Really? Yeah. Alright. They're not too expensive. Not too expensive. I say as I, all my money goes poof. Do 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 do. I wonder if these are actually more important than I thought. They were hitting me pretty hard. Maybe I'm just under leveled. In like previous games, if you're below their level, they pretty they hit pretty hard. If you get to about the level of the monsters, this is when you start kicking butt. If you're above their level by even like one or two levels, you start just destroying them. We'll see, we'll see if it's the same here. I don't know how you do that with your voice, honestly. Well, just, uh, just uh, change voices, uh, practice, and um, being super pro, right? That's uh, the real secret. Be super pro, right? Base slapper, what? That's how you unconfuse somebody, you just go <laughs> Alright, I feel more confident now that we have 15. Uh, can't we just hang out here? Let's go! One on one! My turn! <laughs> Guys out here are definitely lower level. I just destroy them. Well, the guys in that Zeka dungeon are definitely... They're probably five plus levels higher than the guys out here. Let's try going here. Let's do our best. We'll definitely be killing some stuff to level up. This game is slightly different in uh, healing though. Most... Yeah, all the previous games, if you leave a dungeon, you'd get your HP and stuff back. You do not in this one. Can't reach. Can't reach. Leave this to me. Nice. Pro VA. There we go. Hold it, hold. I'm injured. When did I scratch myself? When did I scratch myself? Hmm.
chance to move yourself. You want to, you definitely want to use formation skills. The only one I got right now is a triangle. We got Max Wide and Max Twangles. Let's have them apart like that and see if that, how that spaces out in battle. Oops. Ooh, why'd it have to be this? Yeah, that might kill me. We'll see, we'll see. What are her skills? You can heal too. Ouch. They're so mean. Under it, then. So rude. Probably should heal. Maybe I should heal. Maybe. The tough part is the heals only work on a single person. Rebirth one was definitely the easiest in this regard because comp puts heal. Healed everyone in range. But two, three, and this one are just one at a time. Oh, somebody gonna die. Was. We don't get much HP when we heal. It's only one person. Hey, you sitting there across the screen. Could you maybe uh heal me? So mean! You're there across the screen! So how dare you talk to me this way? Hey Ivor, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? Somebody's gonna die for those. Yeah. Cause I had to kill that Koopo cat thing or Koopo kitty or whatever it is. It had to die. 
which meant that somebody was going to die. Wait. 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 It's probably a portal. I guess you teleport to that. I'll beat you to a bloody pipe been waiting. I'll be serious. I'm a force of fury. get both you got that long range but she doesn't have the uh movement you're kind of rude super pretty boy choose Japanese voice actors in this game or the English has or the game is English only you can choose uh, Japanese how can shows that oh that's just help thought you can't from this menu but there there is Japanese yes Yep, it's gonna be like that until we level up. I can show you how cool I am when I'm fully healed, you know? Shut up. I wonder what's inside. A healing item. Beat you to a bloody pipe. Three super pretty boys, my. What should I do? I'll end this all. So I get a bonus with each of the star flashing ones. This is the combo traits or something, right? I finished this stylishly. I think I do more damage when I do that. Yo, I need to heal soon. Shut up. Hmm. So that one probably doesn't do anything. Is her thing with this weapon's power? So haven't used power it wouldn't help. This one would only work if you, the initial attack was uh, one of the other two, rush or standard. But did super pretty boy ever do it to you that you beat him up? He beat me up first. Hold, you hold your photo or face a lot. You actually dropped it on your face. Your nose hurts a lot. Ah! That'll teach you to, to, to like, um, take gravity for granted. 
You'd be in a bad gal, Ezra. The moveset thing is, is different in this game and it's interesting. Combo traits weren't a thing in any other one, so... Standard. Standard. Set up yet either. A lot of things are standard, standard. Can't you can't do both of those. What do you do to gravity? You, you, you took it for granted. You're just like, eh, gravity wasn't gonna do that to me, and then gravity's like Hold my beer. Let me drop your phone. <laughs> you only do I stream at row guys here? Uh, I've never done those on Twitch because that'll get you banned. That'll get you banned, man. But I, uh, I haven't done it for quite a while. I did used to stream uh, those type of games on Discord, though. But I haven't done it for, like, uh, probably a couple years. I've played a lot of the soccer games, for instance. A lot of them! But I've been playing, like, games that I can actually stream on Twitch more recently, though. Those, oh man. Those were all pretty much before the days where I was saving any VODs, so. Those are all gone to time. He doesn't have anything useful. Unless I do two standards, and then I could do that. Haven't used power. Blah, power. I got. I got to look at the combos every time I get a new weapon because it changes what the one on the left side is, whether it's rush power or standard. Then you have to adjust all your moves for the combo traits. Nyan. This one still work. Uh. This 
not gonna get a combo trait. I only have three open there. I don't have enough moves to really be able to customize too well. Where are you scary people going? Play like five gal games on your life and suddenly three become arrow games. You'd be like, whoa, how'd this happen? Ooh, can I get all three? No! Can't get all three. Be funny if you could. I think I have to settle for two. To what a naughty girl. Hug it out. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Is it because one of them's poisoned or virus, actually? Ah, okay. keep their status effects. They don't keep our EXE draw though. Yeah, I think it's because of the status effect. Alright, alright. Did I see the map again? Let's see back here there. Oh, this map's actually pretty small, isn't it? Hmm. Boing, boing. Gotta be like a teleporter to get up there or something. Next floor. Shut up. Hey look, that's me. What? Like a kangaroo. Like a kangaroo. Oh, what the fuck? Is that terrifying looking thing? Okay, this way looks like the way to go. This way looks like a dead end. That's a lot of fuckers. A lot of dudes. One of them's still virus, though. I don't think it's gonna work. Yeah. I'm a force of fury. Still hasn't recovered. Let's play. Not bad. Not bad. Let's 
Kind of in the way of getting my triangle. My turn. I guess we'll do you. Hello, Pyro. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? You can fire a Glock sideways. Uh. Heal yourself, bitch. You have a heal. You got your own heal and heal yourself. You don't need to ask the person on the other side of the screen for it. Again, weird noises. I don't make weird noises. I make pro noises. I write Oka. Hmm. Room's mysteriously empty. It's not much money. are going this way. As I thought. That's a lot of dudes. You get both? Doesn't seem like it. Only get data hound, huh? I'll be serious. I wouldn't get that other guy, really. Damn 
Okay. What should I do? Maybe I should heal. Maybe you should. yourself you have the heal skill I'll be your personal opponent Don't. I've been waiting Hot edge, huh? I'm still a okay. What's hot edge? And power. Haven't to use to rush? Sure, why not? Oh, wait, we can have that. Of super pretty boys we're eating today. Only the uglies will survive. Well, that's because the uglies didn't attack me. Called this day the pro extermination. That's right. What's those box things again? We'll figure out how to deal with you at some point. Your time is coming. More pretty boys. Lily rank go up. They're not coupled together though. Maybe Lily ranking works differently than in previous games. That's a lot of super pretty boys. What should I do? I'll end this all. I can take out this group. 
I got a lot of turns in there. Wait, what? yourself. Oh, did we get to the next floor? All these boxes are inaccessible. Maybe there's a skill to jump higher like in previous games. Probably. What the hell is this? Alright. Looks like previous character chirpers. Rights from previous games. The factory dev surely likes to beat the super pretty boys. They wanna beat them up. rank goes up even if they're not Injured? coupled together. They're not like... Aren't, they, aren't the last ones they needed to be in the back? And in fights to progress the Lily rank? Now they just do it whatever. Attack missed. It had done that without getting hit, you know. He had to miss, though. Total victory. Whoa. I'll beat you to a bloody poet. What are you guys? goes up by using skills where they work together. That makes sense, I guess.
Wait, there's two exits? Oh. No way, it's over here. Hold up, hold up. Arrive with two HP. My turn. Just easy, easy. Total victory. You're surrounded. What should I do? Strike. What should I do? I'm a force of fury. Alright, defeated. Next! I finished this stylishly. Oh. Well, I'm not going over there. How dare you guys block me? Ooh. I don't seem to have tougher monsters. Uh, previous games had like orange circles for tougher monsters. I, win. I haven't seen those yet. Alright, what? Oh, you're blocked. Event hall. Hmm. What about the other door, though? Observation scope. Huh? What is that? Oh, you're right. When did I 
get this? The other people's heart rate temperature and stuff, huh? Big somehow respawns and defeated foes. Oh yeah, I have noticed that the enemies don't come back after 30 seconds like previous games. I think they do come back, but it's much longer. This will save getting that item. In case we die, I don't think we'll die, but still. Will we finally encounter voice acting that's not done by Moa? No. Didn't think so. That should do it. <sighs> You're running around too fast, Izume. I'm all tuckered out. Poor thing. Come on, Nepsy. You gotta shape up if this much running will exhaust you. Oh, you're just too energetic. Right, Nipgear? Huh? Actually, I feel okay with this much movement. Betrayal! Well, Nepsy, all you've been doing lately is eating a bunch of pudding and rolling around. Thank you, Miss Uzume. On behalf of my tribe, we're very grateful. It was seriously no problem. You don't need to thank me. You did find me a bunch of share crystals, after all. We gotta help each other out. Uh, this is... It's share energy from Hell's Crest. All right, Uzume! You got some shares here, too! It's like you're a heroine in a dating sim where the more you raise your friendship with monsters, the more shares you get. Wait, why is that a dating sim? She's like, what the fuck? Oh, wait, no, she's getting remembered. East War. <laughs> Uzume! Hey, Uzume! Are you alright, Uzume? Y yeah, I'm alright. I got so worked up, I ended up getting hungry and just got a little dizzy. You liar. Ooh, I see. In here, I was all worried. Jeez, you sure know how to worry people. My bad. Here, take this. This is just pudding, right? It's not your average everyday pudding. It's 50% kindness, 50% divine protection, 100% pretty cool. The CPU of Planetune's been warming it in her pocket since the morning. R right, that's why it's lukewarm. Now then, could you guide us to where the arcade cabinets are located? They're over there. Please follow me. A lot of sounds. Back now that I remember, I saw the Ugly Boys 2 attacking you. They were called a Taco A or B or something like that. Yeah, there were like ones like that in the previous games. They're probably around here in this game somewhere. Tch, it got away. What a quick bastard. Junior, it went over that way. Go get it. Yes, le leave it to me. I did it, Neptune. I got the headshot. You really are good at this. I'm shocked you'd get MVP twice in a row. A am I? There you go again, being all humble and stuff. You're my prided little sis, so have some more confidence. I'm gonna go... I'm gonna get MVP in the next stage this time, so watch out. Keep dreaming. I'm the one who'll be crowned MVP. Uzume looks like she's having so much fun. I think this might be the first time I've seen her in such high spirits. She had been concerned with nothing but the giant until now. It has been a long while for me as well. This face truly does suit her. Nep Jr., is there any sort of trick to winning at this? If there is, could you teach only me discreetly? Um, you see, when you fire, you should squeeze your arms to yourself and aim. That way the sight won't shake and... Hey, that isn't fair. Keeping those kinds of tricks secret, you better tell me too. Of course. Then please come over here and I'll... Hmm? What's up, Gearsy? 
That's right. That's it. It was that simple. Why didn't I figure out something this simple sooner? All we have to do is solve everything in this world before heading back to our world. That way, no one has to say goodbye. No way. Whew, we ran through these cabinets pretty fast. Man, games are really fun when you play them with others. If it's always this fun, I want to come here every day with you two. I agree. We should definitely do this again sometime. Looks like our plan worked. She really is your sister if her mood gets better from playing games. Huh? What do you mean? Uh, what the hell? Uh-oh. What's May? Over there. There's something in the back. Huh. This fool was hiding the whole time. No, wait. That wasn't Umio. That was Uzume. Oh, this fool was hiding the whole time. A silhouette and equipment. I think it's military grade. This is just a guess by looking at the frame it's using. But its AI is probably a few decades old. But... That's only a guess based on what I've seen in our world. It might have a special program or armament included with it, so please be careful. Hipgear's looking like she's back to normal. Although, I have absolutely no idea what she just said. But I can vouch for how strong she is when she gets rid of her doubts. Enough chit-chat. Let's scrap this heap of junk already. Everyone Let's do it. Lend me your strength. Waiting. Let's do it. I'd heal. Or I'll say. Let's go. I'll follow you. I'll end this all. Break your burden. To the chest. I've been waiting. What should I do? It's just defense for a single ally. My turn. To the chest. My turn. Here we go. I'll leave things to you. I'll nip you all up. Wait, I can't reach you? Really? You're just out of range. You're no fun, then. Give it your all! Thanks! Go for it! Target's done for it! This is fast! I'm a force of fury! Break your burden! Rest! I'll be serious! Ouchie. Heart's break. Oh yeah, I totally forgot about port breaking. Here, heal up. Thanks, Major. 
Can I say a plan? Wow, we got a plan. Level up. Hooray! Rapid rush? I did it! I leveled up! Whew, that thing was all show. Um, Neptune, would it be okay if I disassembled this robot? Sure, but don't make a mess. Okay, I promise. Where should I start taking it apart? From the chest? Maybe the head? Starting from the feet and working my way up sounds pretty intuitive too. It's a trip that the first thing she thinks about after killing this machine is taking it apart like some toy model. Can't be helped. Nepgear loves to tinker. It's in her blood. Oh! Hmm, what's wrong? Did we find a replacement part? I just found a replacement for that broken terminal part. Are you serial? That means we can fix the transfer terminal. Woohoo, we did it! You still gotta get power. Hmm, I might make another lucky find. I'll try taking apart some other places. We came to have fun, but it would seem we found quite the windfall. You can say that again. Yersi cheered up, too. It's a good thing we came here. Wow. So exciting. Time to go install it. Maybe you guys will level up later, but right now you're too weak. Let's try going here. Hope you'll be enough to entertain My me. Turn. I'll be serious. Hmm, I don't think I can get both. Oh yeah. Never mind. Combo arts. Oh yeah, Nepgear got a combo too, didn't she? First attack did not use combo tray. this one. Use three, but I don't have a third one. Sad. I choose you. Uh, can't we 
just hang out here? Pudding, pudding. Pudding, 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 pudding. A repair's done. Yes, the repair was successful. What the fuck? Voice acting, professional paid voice acting in my video game? Excuse me? Uh, unheard of. That's great. You girls can go home to your own world. It's insane. Yeah, but it's kind of hard to celebrate knowing there's probably piles of work to deal with back home. I can already hear Isti's eternal, boring, luxury voice in my head. Would it happen to sound like this? That is so spot on, Uzume. Wow! That sounds just like... Wait, Isti? Why are we on a call with her? I'm sorry, Neptune. Since I just finished repairs, I thought to call you Squar right away. I answered this call, holding the highest hopes for you both to return quickly. But hearing these complaints from Neptune is just too much. So, if you so desire, Neptune may return to tend to business over here. And, Neptune, you may very well stay in that world for eternity. Aw, oh, come on, Isti. I was only joking. You already know that's not how I feel. It was just one of those nep jokes all my fans online are into these days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A nep joke? Do you mean, um... Um, it doesn't matter. You must return at once, so I may lecture you. A meme? This game reminds me a little of Date Alive. Ooh, I haven't played that. Is that cool? What? Now that the device has been repaired, we must solve our energy dilemma. Yeah, I was thinking, maybe we can use this. Isn't that... a share crystal? Uzume, that's a sweet gesture, but we couldn't possibly dream of using such a precious item. That's right. Without those, how are you gonna transform, huh? We can't take them. It's fine. I was able to defeat the giant thanks to you girls, and now all I got left is to crush that purple hag who likes to pop up everywhere. And, although it's not a huge amount, I'm able to receive shares from monsters now, so I don't even need these anymore. If I do need more someday, I can always just go search for some. It's okay, right, Umio? Yes, absolutely. I agree with Uzume. Thank you, Uzume. We're never going to forget you. Yeah, neither will I. Seriously, I won't ever forget you, Nepsi. They're totally separating now. Totally. Nepsi, are you ready? Enter the coordinates I specify into the end gear. I will take care of the controls for the transfer afterwards. Um, Eastwar, could you wait for us to return a little bit longer? What? What are you saying? Please, do not tell me Neptune's propensity for slacking off has influenced you. Our only salvation is your earnestness, Neptune. So if you take on Neptune's trace, I do not know if I could ever face our past CPUs again. Wait up. Am I being dissed right now? Yep. No. I just want to finish helping Uzume before I return home. Uzume, I'm here for you until the end. So once we defeat R4 and ensure everyone's safety here, why don't you come back with us to our world? My sister will be there, and there are so many games and food to try out. You can even check out all my gadgets. Hmm. I get it. That's what this is about. You sisters have been so kind. You care so much about someone like me, a complete stranger. Thank you, Gearzy. Then, does this mean you'll come? I'm really happy for the sentiment, but I'm sorry. I just can't go with you there. But why? It's 
far too lonely to stay in a world like this completely by yourself. Gearzy, this is just how it is, and you have no idea what'll happen if you stay. You gotta get home while you still can. I don't... Uh-uh. What the hell's this noise? These sounds, they appear to be coming from outside. Whoa. <laughs> Monsters, destroy this building. They ruined my plans, and I will ruin their escape. How does she know we were trying to leave? Actually, shouldn't you be happy about that? If they left, you wouldn't have to deal with them. I'm not sure if there's data live games, but that is the anime. The likenesses of the characters are identical. Oh, really? Maybe Tsunako is the same illustrator? Maybe. Maybe. It's not exactly a, a unique looking style, though. Lots of cute anime girls. you dang it Uzume and Nep Jr. were having a touching plot developing moment and you had to go break it up that's supposed to be my job dummy I was getting some of my best jokes ready to make it so embarrassing for them do you think the nickname seriousness breaker just came by chance no I earned this name and I'm not losing it to you Arbor Bower. Who the hell is Arbor? And I don't even need your ridiculous second name. Arbor, Arsnor, Archor, Alba. Then, what's your objective? <gasps> Are you trying to steal my spot as the protagonist? Hmm. Mega Dimension Destructor R4. Well, now that you mention it. Taking your spotlight sounds like a brilliant idea. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. So she'll be the new protagonist. Ha! Hey, did you hear that, Nep Jr.? Mega Dimension Destructor R4. What's with that face? You shouldn't laugh, Neptune. Not when she's so serious. But, I mean, using the name Destructor? It's so freaking lame! I believe her intentions may have been Destroyer, but who's to say, really? Uh, shut up! Always finding a way to make a mockery of me. You will not be forgiven, brats. Cute when you're all red and embarrassed, Arfie. You should leave her be, big sis. The last thing you want to do is cross the line with a crazy person. Actually, she's right. She's clearly not thinking straight to be dressing like that at her age. What? You're gonna mock her clothing? Even more so than youngsters these days. We have no idea what she'll do if she snaps. We must treat her delicately. I don't think a fish has any uh, legs to stand on when uh, commenting on other people's choice of dress. I don't know. Get it? Because he has no legs. I'm talking English sounds wrong. I know, right? It's like, oh my god, professional paid voice acting in my video game? What the hell? What's going on here? Continue to gossip about my impeccable fashion sense. My original plan was only to cast you all into the depths of despair, but that's changed. I will end you here and now. <laughs> cast into the depths of despair. The depths of despair, she says. What is this? A freshman poetry class? I've never seen anyone outside a game use that phrase. What a riot. She ain't wrong. Pepsi's instigations are also at fault. And it seems her resistance to being appropriately serious is a problem as well. 
I won't allow any further insults, you scum! Go, my monsters! Crush those dwarfs and take down the entire building! Uh-oh. Hope you'll be enough to entertain my me. Turn. Uh oh. Well, uh, that's clearly not the actual fight. That's round one. That's a mean fish. I know, right? Who just goes commenting on people's clothes? That's so rude. Especially since you're a fish and aren't even wearing any. Uh, who are you to give fashion advice? Come on, now. What kind of woman? <laughs> yeah, our fort's got it going on, right? There are too many of them! What's wrong? I expected more from you CPUs. There are just too many. We're overwhelmed. Let's take cover in that building for now. You're really telling me to show my back to this pop-up jackass? Way past uncool. Uzume, calm yourself. Her objective is to destroy the transfer terminal and prevent Nepsi and Gearsy from leaving this world. We don't have to face her directly, or even fight her fairly. As long as our friends here escape, we can consider this battle won. All right, I get it now. If that's the case, then let's hurry it up and get him out of here. Nepsi, Gearsy, let's fall back to the terminal. What? We're not even done here. Yeah, Uzume, there's still lots of months. Change of plan. I'll get you up to speed in a little bit. Just get inside ASAP. It'll probably be a while before they can clear a path to the entrance here. Jeez, that hag's personality is super rotten. Bringing along a horde of monsters to attack us right at the last second. Dumb. What should we do, though? There are so many! Hey, why are you sweating it, Gearsy? It's seriously nothing to worry about. I'm gonna transfer you guys now. Hurry and get inside the terminal. Just a dang minute! No way! We can't just leave you with this horde right outside! It's totally cool. Compared to that giant, these wimps don't mean a thing. That must have been the door breaking down. We have no time. Get in the terminal, you two. Gearsy, give Eastwar the transfer signal. My preparations are complete. I am aware of your situation via the end gear as well. Okay, you two are in. Good. I didn't think our farewell would be this hectic, but hey, you stay safe when you get back, all right? Only if you promise not to push yourself, Uzume. I promise. As soon as you two leave, I'm gonna make a run for it. I don't believe that. Don't worry, pro. Chloe's you're still number one gal. You hear that? You're number one! She's like... <sighs> sleeping. I'm sure she heard that, okay? I found you, little brats. Oh, crap. She's already here. See you, Nepsy and Gearsy! Transfer initiated. I'm too late. You will pay for this with your life! What? Huh? Nepgear! Nepgear! Uh, only Neptune got teleported. No! Not just me, bring back my friends!
Hey, this was a serious situation. You can't just go to Nep Station. Don't touch that dial. Nep Station started yet again. Nepsy went back to her own world, so we'll be hosting this episode. Huh? This program isn't related to the main story, so shouldn't Neptune be here? Uh, I just may have forgot that. But, well, let's not get caught up in any legal TV nonsense, Kirsi. Besides, it's a nice change of pace to have us two instead of Nepsy. You're right. Then may I ask you to do the customary episode preview? Leave it to me. I've got a great one. Nepsy returns to her world, but that was only the beginning. Nepsy tries to run from her work, but Istoire is dead set on making her do the, her job. Next episode, Unfamiliar Work. We'll give you a service next time, too. Get excited. Let's meet again next time. Bye-bye. All right. I've arrived in the hyper dimension. Woohoo! Wait, this isn't the time to celebrate. Isti, Isti, it's an emergency. Um, wait, Isti? That's weird. She's usually in my face as soon as I walk in, barraging me with a weird combo of welcome home and random lectures. Hey! Isti! I'm here! Holy crackers! Isti's passed out! Hey, Isti, are you alright? Yikes! She's burning up! <sighs> welcome home. I'm glad you made it safely back. I'm not important at the moment. Right now, I'm just worried about you. What happened? It is most embarrassing, but I tried my best to accomplish a task far above my specifications. Oh, Isti, you were doing this for us? Oh. By the way, where is Nep? What? Did Isti just short circuit? Why isn't she getting back up? Oh no 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 no! What the heck should I do? Jeez, Nep, what's this racket about? You haven't even been back five minutes, and you're making a scene. You should at least come say hi first. Why is IF question mark? Because we don't know who she is if we just started this game and don't know the previous series, right? Ever saw a meme about listening to Mozart twice in the Bible in Chinese? The N.A. of our soul at all? Uh, no. I've never seen that. Crazy memes these days. What are these youngsters up to? Here is Iffy. She works as a guild agent in Planetune, and she's a dear old friend of mine. Hey, come on, don't get weird. Did you want to see us that badly? Iffy! All right, all right, get off it already. Stop crying and getting your snot all over me. But, but, Isti is. Eastwar is what? Wait, Eastwar? Nep, what's going on? Well, you see, then yada yada blah and... This and that and the other thing, I see. Ooh, just as I'd expect from you, Iffy. We're definitely kindred spirits, if you can understand that. Whether we're kindred spirits really isn't important right now. We need to do something to help Eastwar. Nep, help me carry her. All right, we've laid her down for now. This is pretty troubling. I've called Kampa, but we don't know if the treatments we used are gonna work. Sorry to keep you waiting, Iffy. Oh, welcome home, Nep-Nep. Long time no see, Kampa. Hmm? 
Well, you're not that worried about me being gone, perchance. Ah, uh, well, this isn't really the first time you've disappeared without telling anyone, Nepna. I figured you'd suddenly reappear eventually, like you usually do. Uh-huh. I can't tell whether you're really confident in me or if you just think I'm some kind of careless fool. Why not both? This girl here's Kampa. Just like Ify, she's a great friend of mine. She's a newbie, but nursing is her current occupation, and she works in public hospitals. Sorry for calling you so suddenly, Kampa. It's no big deal when it's a request from you, Ify. And it's been quite a while since I've had a chance to see Nepnep. -Nep. So, do you think you can take a look at Eastwar? Her condition doesn't seem to have evolved from the stuff I texted you about earlier. Leave it to me! Well, I want to say that, but I think it'll be impossible with normal treatment methods. If I remember correctly, isn't she that artificial life form created by the Planetoon CPU from forever ago? Yes, indeedy! I think it was a CPU named SC or SG or something like that. Then, do you think there might be a user's manual for Risty floating around somewhere? If it exists, I think some kind of troubleshooting information might be able to help us out. But nobody reads the manuals. Nobody does that. You get a new thing, you just turn it on. You don't read the manual. The only time you'd ever possibly read a manual, a guide or whatever, is like if you get like a bookshelf or something, you need to put it together. And you, then you look at the the diagrams and you're like, uh, I put the what? Where? Wait, what am I doing? That's the only time you read any manual. Sure, you start at seven. Why not one, two, three, four? I mean, I'm busy at one, two, three, four. stream when I stream. I stream when I can stream. <laughs> Cop a long time didn't see her. True, true, true. What's up? What's happening? How's it going, King? How you doing tonight? Hope you're doing well. We're continuing our first playthrough of this cool game. Yeah, I get back to the other dimension like now. What are we doing? What are we doing? A user's manual? Even if one existed, I really doubt it's still around here. It'd be so old. Yes, seriously, she's not some run-of-the-mill consumer electronics device, so there isn't... Wait! There totally is an instruction manual! Are you kidding me? No joke, Ify. I distinctly remember Isti going on and on about her manual once, many Planetune moons ago. I think I might remember that. You meant the game starting at the seventh one? Oh. It's actually not seven, it's V2. Is it how it's uh, pronounced? V2! This is actually the fourth game. And I have done the previous ones. I did the first game like two years ago. I did the second and third game last year. Now we're doing the fourth game. I agree the V2 part makes it look like seven though. I guess they wanted everybody to think it was the seventh one. Maybe it is the seventh if you consider all the spinoffs. I'm not sure. I think it's V for Victory, because the third game was called Victory on the PS3 version. So this is probably supposed to be like Victory 2. I don't know. We have 200 KOs left for Rocket Arena Plat. Wow! Got that theme from Mega Dimension of Tiny V2. Whoa, that's cool! You're getting toward the Rocket Arena then. That's shutting down at the end of the month, isn't it? Go, 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 go. You don't know any of these characters? Oh, I know all these characters. These three on the screen here have been here since the first game. I, I do find it funny they were question marked in the beginning, though. I think they were question marked in case you did start with this game. You wouldn't know who they were.
Maybe Compa will join our party. Her heals are pretty good, her because her heals are AoE. Or at least they were in previous games, so she could heal anyone in the area instead of just herself. Or just one person. Done that on the 21st. That's nine days away! Go, 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 Well, now we're in this world. Let's get it done. How dare you not put the other two in my party? <laughs> An item has been added to the shop. What item? You can't just say item without telling me which one. The weapon? Probably the weapon. New weapon. Now, that means it's going to totally change the combos, right? Oh, yeah, this one's standard. Weight is. Hey Enigma, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Meow. Whoa. Let's oh, nap nap. Yeah, let's do it. Hey, you there. Let's cheer Lady Nep on together. Our Nep fan club is always accepting new members, so just give me a call whenever you feel up to it. Uh, yeah, let's do it. You gonna just repeat? Yeah. Uh, you okay? Hey, hey, you over there! Won't you try joining our Lady Nep fan club? If you join, you can see the intense doji of Lady Nep, Lady Noir that was banned from our sales booth. Nep Noah forever! Uh, uh, sure. Cleaning robot? Cleaning robot? What's a face? Where did that girl go? Did you bid do with the to the V I I R? Isn't that one like a VR game? At least I thought it was. I don't know the difference between that one and this one. Huh? Could this be an instruction manual? Could it be? Could it be? Now then, we were able to find the instruction manual, but. There are too many sections with. If you think she's broken, then... That's the header, so it might take a while to find. Let's try out this simple diagnostic sheet. All we gotta do is answer yes or no to the questions on it. This kind of looks like fun. Let's give it a try. Alright, I'll start. Um, is she unconscious? Yes. Next is, has her body gone cold? Nope. Next, is she automatically restarting repeatedly? Hmm, looks like a no. Next is, did she try completing a task beyond her specifications? Uh, what's with this incredibly pinpointed question? So, what's the answer, Nap? Now that I think about it, Isty mentioned trying something that was above her specs before she passed out. As expected of Histoire. She left us a helpful clue while taking her last few breaths. How nice. Oh there, Kampa. Don't just kill her off like that. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, well, let's answer yes to that one. So that leads to... She has short-circuited. Please apply the Sanchiro Soulful Patch. She will revive with sheer willpower. Revive with sheer willpower? That's a pretty vague repair method. But if this is all we can rely on, then we have to try finding that patch. You're right. I guess that's where we're at then. Nep, sorry for asking you right after you got back, but can you go look for it? You got it! Wait, from your wording just now, does that imply you're not coming with me, Iffy? I really do want to go with you, but we can't just leave the Basilicom empty. The atmosphere's bad enough because of the CPU shift period, so if something were to happen, it'd be a problem. Then how about I stay at the Basilicom and you can go look for it? You're more of an expert at finding things. Lazy. That's true, but what are you going to do if there's some serious crisis in Planetune while I'm gone? Up until now, Eastwar managed everything on her own. But can you really take her place in confidence? Ooh. Ah, well... No. With the other nations, their CPUs always deal with these internal issues. But if you can't, we've no choice but for me to stay. Oof, that's an extremely good point. Well, you'll come along with me, right, Kappa? Sorry, gotta work my shift. I want to go too, but it would be bad if something happened to East War, so... Do your best, Nep Nep! Yeah, I figured as much. I'll search for information and clues. Two. Why is there a random period after clues? F12. What? So if I find something helpful, I'll call you. Supposed to be a comma, probably. A remake of this game? Oh, really? It'd have a different list to be able to play it in VR, but you don't need it. Oh, I thought it was a VR-only game. They already went and remade this one? This one doesn't seem like it's that old. How dare they! Again, they've remade the first game, like, twice, right? They got Rebirth, and then they got that Reverse or whatever. They like to remake their previous games. You should try to help Eastwar out every once in a while. Never. Uh, my head... Uh, my head is hot. My consciousness is hazy. Oh my. What's that face? Ah! Question marks? Histoire is power at this rate. I don't know who's talking. If I just disappeared, if everyone forgot. Maybe it's Sanchiro. Hold on. No, please do not go. He's uh, mm. having a dream. A war. Jeez, why does that girl never call me? Alright, now how should I even look for clues? Without Isti here, I can't do anything for Napgear, so I gotta work fast. But I'm so bad at looking for stuff. You know, it really, it wouldn't hurt to rely on us every once in a while, would it? Huh? Welcome home, Neptune. Welcome back, Neptune. War and Uni? Why are you two here? Wait, do I remember what their voices were? No. Okay. Posture check. How dare you? Uh, posture check. I don't wanna. Ugh. What? I pressed the button. Whoa! There's a log. Must be uh, L2 then. Oh. No! I pressed some button that brought up that log. I don't know what button though. You eat all of the nut pudding? How dare you! I have called and said you had gotten caught up in some kind of trouble again. And he swore fainted, so she asked me to help you. Ooh, how very thoughtful of Iffy! Hmm, but then, isn't it a little fast for you to have gotten here? Th those kinds of small details don't matter. 
What's important right now is Histoire and... She was already here. Oh, I know. I bet you flew over here at mock speeds because you wanted to see me so bad. Who would go flying anywhere to come see you? I just thought I would offer you help as a fellow CPU is all. Oh, there you go again. You never say your feelings honestly. But what do you mean by that? It's not like I'd be lonely at all if you never come back. That was her voice again. Let me think. That's just like Neptune. She's always right on the money with Noir. But still, what's Neptune thinking? Letting herself get left behind like that? She hasn't even called to check in with me. I wish she'd be considerate enough about me to know that it's making me so worried. Hee mm. <laughs> hee, Noir is a lonely loner. How could you say that? I told you to stop yelling weird things like that in a place like this. Oh, I bopped somebody. Ouch. Hey. Who the heck are you? Oh, oh, oh. Wait, tsk, tsk. You tripped up an innocent bystander. Um, 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 who is this? We've never seen this lady before. She looks suspiciously like a, um, uh, she's gonna be like a DLC character who joins the party. I've had those in previous games. Whose fault do you think that is? Jeez. I'm sorry, are you hurt? Uh, oh no, I'm fine. Are you alright? As you can see, I'm perfectly alright. I really am sorry. My companion here was getting herself involved in some ridiculous antics. It's alright. I was lost in thought myself, so we can call it even. It's nice of you to say so. Well then, we'll be excusing ourselves. Are those people possibly... Lady Neptune and Lady Noir? Oh. Jeez, because of you, I caused someone unnecessary trouble. No matter how you look at it, you're the bad one for being distracted. Um, it's fine to have an argument and all, but I think we should focus on helping Istoir out. Ooh, right, of course! I need to find something called Sanchiro's Soulful Patch. Would you know where that, where it might be? Sanchiro's Soulful Patch, is it? I have never heard of the item itself, but isn't Sanchiro one of Planet Toon's great men? Wait, men? Men in my video game? A man? Excuse me? What? He is goaded in the stream. That's rah, that's rah, that's rah, that's rah, that's rah. Or just like me, for real, for real. Aww. Wait, maybe that's why Noir is like number one. Wasn't she like, uh... Well, number one in that popularity contest in a previous game or something. I don't know, I don't know. I don't remember. Wouldn't it be located in Planeptune somewhere? If I knew that, I wouldn't be having problems. Let's split up and look for it. We'll meet back here in two hours. Let's go, Uni. Okay. Noir really never changes. She still helps me out no matter what comes out of her mouth. The epitome of a sundere. Guess I should get to looking around, too. It takes a Nep Miso technique. A call from Nep to... So technique. Let's go. Did Sanchiro say Gata? Probably not. I'm a lone or not lonely. That's the war. I'm a normal everyday CPU who, at the moment, is making a mad dash to gather information. If I were to say how I'm different, it's probably that I change looks drastically before and after I transform. My name's Neptune. Why are you introducing yourself? Is we, we're we're like we're like. We're like eight hours into this game. Well, eight hours my time. I, I'm a slowpoke. Well, now. I came all the way out here to this park, searching for information on an item that would save a shorted out Isti. Okay. 
as I casually glanced aside. Why are you, like, narrating it? I saw, I saw, a saw, a saw, what? F12, it's supposed to be I saw. I saw a young man sitting alone on a bench. And some park man, oh my god. He's got, like, a drawing. He's not just black silhouette or whatever. What the heck? He has a face. I don't know how I feel about this. And some park man. What's with the, like... Shall we... D d is he gonna ask her to dance? Like, what's with the D? Uh, talk about it? I don't really understand how, but I've ended up having a conversation with this handsome loser of a man. <laughs> so mean. So what is it you, that you want to talk to me about? Depending on the topic, I might report you. Uh, please rest assured, I'm sorry, but you land quite a ways outside of my strike zone. Ooh. Ooh. Damn. What I wanted to speak to you about was the CPU of this nation, Lady Neptune. From what I've heard, lately she hasn't shown up for public services, and she's shut herself up to play around. On top of that, her chest hasn't developed at all for a few years now. She's flat as a board. Why is that a problem? That last point aside, maybe she's had some extenuating circumstances out of her control? You know, she might have been sick or had to go far away for work. I suppose it could be thought of that way, too. I bet you're the kind of guy that takes what's written on the internet at face value. That's why you're so suspicious of the CPU. How did you know? You have that kind of look about your face. But you shouldn't believe those kinds of groundless rumors. A great person once said it's difficult to go on using a forum without being a person capable of seeing through lies. I think you should have a little more confidence in your own convictions. It often happens that malicious people spread strange rumors for fun, you know. Y you're right. I'm sorry. Thanks to you, I've opened my eyes. Yeah, okay. I'll be taking my leave now. Whew, I had no idea what would happen when he criticized me by name, but I guess these things turn out alright sometimes. But jeez, Louise, who is it? Who's posting weird brimmers about me online? Oh, I don't know. Who could it be? A call from Neptune. Bring, bring. It'd be cooking if Sanchira Segata does an appearance here. Somehow I don't think so, but... You know, anything can happen. Only need to get Hyperdimension Neptunia 1. Oh, like the first one on PS3. Where it all began. Hello, blonde! If it isn't Neptune, when did you get back home? I got back just now, actually. I'm actually calling to ask a favor of you. I understand the situation. It's best to look for your answer in books at a time like this. There might be a description written in an old technical document or something like that. As expected of you, Blonde. I would have never thought to look into printed materials. I can help you with investigations, at least. You better try your best, too. It's like having a hundred strong behind me with your help, Blonde. I'll talk to you later. Better in her up. Hmm, books, huh? Where's a place that has books? Oh, uh, let me think. Uh, I think it starts with an L. Found one. I'll skedaddle on over. Whoa. Who is this lady? <laughs> it looks very serious. Store clerk has a picture too. The random side characters have have faces now. They're they're not just store clerk, no picture. Yes, first Neptunia. Need to buy it physical since it's not on the PS3 store. Ah. K2 and Victor are ten dollars on the PS3 store. Ooh. That's, that's probably not a bad price. 
Cause this coal probably costs more than that. Welcome! Question mark. She looks so serious. There's all these new characters. When you say books, you definitely think of the supermarket. Let's see. The comic book section is over here. Has this bitch never heard of a library? Goddamn. What the fuck is this? A robot. Hmm. So this is the... Uh, oh wait, is this a, a lady robot? A guy robot? Oh, so this is the adult magazine that the general requested. Wait, what? However, there are two women at the register. This is most troubling. There seems to be a ninja mumbling to himself in the corner of the book section. Game industry sure has a variety of citizens. Uh, this was a, not a ninja, but okay. Ninja robot. Here it is! Ooh! New volumes are out! For Roll Girl 13 and Zobra! Yeah. Wait, I'm not here to look for these. Hmm... Ah, over here! Times like these are when I turn up... I turn to Nep Nep Mystery Reporter! NMR for short, for inspiration! I'll just put this in my basket along with this candy box that has a prize in it! Bring me up, please! All right. It's almost time to meet up with Noir and the others. It's almost time to rendezvous. Noir's not here yet? Since I probably have some time to kill, maybe I'll peruse the book I bought. Hmm, the secret of crop circles. Nepstrodamus's prophecies. Grand crosses and spiritual civilizations, etc., etc. All of them look intriguing, but they don't seem related to the item I'm looking for. Huh? What's this prophecy of the Golden Summit? I love these sorts of occult stories, and even I've never heard of this. Wearing golden armor, he shall stand in game industry. Finding the, finding the lost people's bonds, he will finally lead them to the Golden Summit. Wait, didn't I, watch a didn't I just watch a movie or read a manga or something that said something like this? But I don't think it has anything to do with my item search. Sorry to make you wait. Did you find anything? Well, I bought a book and read it up. But I've got nothing. Read it up? I've never heard of reading up a book before. It's news to me. Yep, the Mandal Library books and played up to this rock. Hey, Guru. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? Them prof high boys. What? What are you talking about? My voice is deep all the time. I don't know what you mean. Talk about sexy. What? What are you talking about? You crazy person. When you say book, do you mean that? Yep, but why? You're hopeless. Well, whatever. I'm thirsty from walking for so long. So why don't we talk over an ice cold drink? You betcha! I'm kind of parched myself. Alright, let's do it. I saw a pretty neat place on the way over, so let's go there. If you're sure about it, we should strike while the oven's hot. Hey, what? Is that even how that saying goes? Why are you running? I haven't even told you where it is yet. Oh wait, I just added the yet. There's no yet. Wait, who the fuck's this? It looks suspiciously like Usume, though. She's, uh, she's this version of Usume or something. I've arrived! Whoops, looks like I came way before our meeting time. No one's here yet. Hmm? A book in this place? Maybe someone forgot it. I think I'll read it a bit. Oh, this is the one... Did Neptune drop her book? Uh-huh. Hmm... What? What did you say? At this rate, game industry is gonna fall into ruins. I is there any way to avoid destruction? Found something. Prophecy of the Golden Summit. I'm sure this is it. Oh, who's this? Who is this lady? Ooh, ooh. Who are all these new characters? Should really consider voice acting. Ugh. I'll be in all your favorite animes, totally. Um, I'm staring. She's got a very nice, uh, hat. Yeah, the hat. The hat. 
Hey there, Bisha. Oh, Zisha. What kind of names are these? I've made a huge discovery. Game industry is going to be destroyed. Huh? It's pretty quiet here, so we should be able to talk at our leisure. Ooh, I'm surprised that such a fancy place exists in Plan Upton. Why wouldn't it? This is the lobby of your nation's hotel, you know. Oh, well. Looks like Blonde and Vert conducted their own investigations. So let's have a meeting through group chat. Uni, please set it up. Leave it to me, Noir. Let's see. Gotta call both Blonde and Vert. Here we go. Wow, it's Vert. We've been waiting. Did you find any information? Not at all. And you? I tried studying Game Industries' ancient documents, but there was nothing about the item we're looking for. I see. What about you, Vert? There was no concrete information, but I did find a location that was sacred land of the first CPU of Planeptune. There's a possibility that the CPU who created Histoire has left something there. To be honest, that sounds pretty fake. Where did you get that information? A forum somewhere. I knew it! I knew it! Do you have to ask? And Chan, of course. And Chan? Tan Chan? I don't know, fuck care. Isn't that where all the hoaxes and rumors seep out of? Aside from all the lewd pictures of CPU spanking each other? Ugh. Wait, what? How, how do you know about this? Uh, have you been there? Is this, is, is, is this where you hang out, Noir? How do you know about this? I found the Nepstrodamus prophecies. You should watch Neptunia anime if you didn't yet. Yeah, I haven't watched that yet. Perhaps, but there are experts. You would never expect to find lurking those boards. Okay. Besides, in Four Goddesses Online 2, Oh, that's the MMO I'm currently playing, but... A friend from there happens to be a professor of archaeology and history at a certain university, and they had heard of the same legend. Which means the best we have is that sacred land. You're going to believe that? This is the map I received from that professor. Wait. Wow, what an unexpected windbag to find information on online boards and games. Don't you mean windfall? That's another way of putting it. Like the correct way of putting it. And let's all head to this place together. I don't think I've been here before either. In regards to accompanying you, I apologize, but it is difficult for me to offer you any more assistance. Same, I do want to go with you, but my hands are tied up with some domestic difficulties. Uh-oh. My reasons are similar. I must catch the parties responsible for spreading false rumors and lies about me. <gasps> Since this is Vert, I've made the assumption that she was busy with online games. Huh? But didn't she mention something about her online friend just now? Well, that can't be helped. The three of us can go then, right, Noir? Uni? Um, well, about that, Neptune... You wouldn't be like that, right, Noir? My kindred spirit, best friend, best buddy. Uh, yes. Uh. How do you always anticipate me like that? Seriously, you too, Noir? It's the CPU shift period. Last station's in the same position as those two, with rumors and lies spreading. And why did you come here? Isn't it busy? That's, you know, Uni. It was Uni. What? What? Uni absolutely had to help out so that Nipgear could get home. And being impressed by her show of friendship, I came to help as her sister. Sure. So, so don't get the wrong idea. What are you saying, Noir? You said you'd keep that a secret. Oof. And besides, you're the one who wanted to see Neptune and was saying she can't do anything without you. Yeah. What, what kind of nonsense are you spouting? 
Oh, ho, ho. so Noir said that. I see. You, stop grinning. Jeez, we're going home, Uni. We already helped you out, Neptune, so do the rest yourself. And do it right. See you later, Neptune. Please take care of Nepgear. Ah, Noir, Uni. They left. They didn't even finish drinking the tea they ordered. All by myself now. But I was able to find an objective thanks to everyone's help. I better try my best. Alright, I better hurry out. Where should I try looking first? Nap, wait up a sec. A second. Oh, Iffy! You're coming with me after all? <sighs> I managed to catch up. No, I told you we're moving separately. We just got permission to use route building. It's an emergency, so lay out the route and build it as fast as you can. But what? Route? Building? What's that? Right now, there are plans to improve the transportation network over the entire nation. It won't be normal roads, but light paths created by share energy. Thanks to the CPU's power, paths that took days to traverse will take much less time. So people can walk to places they couldn't before. Uh, light speed walkways. Well, uh, when, are, when are we getting those IRL, man? As you know, our economy's not that great lately, so we're trying to stimulate the flow of people and goods. Wow, amazing! So we're switching from analog to optical lines. Nominally, this area is going to be moving with your protection. Only one part's been constructed, but since it's an emergency, we have permission from the Basilicom to send the route out. If you specify a point where you want to use route building, we'll immediately connect the route to that point. They've also said that Planeptune will cover the funds this time. Ooh, how generous! Then I'll go ahead and connect the routes, then head out. Thanks, Iffy! Be careful out there. H M S D route building. The path to your destination will be created via route building. Whoa. Okay, so it's basically the thing from the last world area. With route building, you can create new routes to traverse on the world map. When your destination point is not connected to any routes, you can open the way to it with route building. Okay. In order to route build, you will have to pay a certain amount of credits for each point. Building your route is as easy as selecting your point and paying credits. There are also some points that will cost no credits at all. Whoa! Before a million credit route, and I'll be like, <sighs> too expensive. After route building is finished, it will then be possible to move to that point. You will have expanded the area you are able to adventure in, and the story will advance. Depending on the point, there are times when you will not be able to route build. It may be possible to build to that point from a different town, so try out different places. Ah. Hmm. Okay. You gotta go to the left. This man, you're gonna tell us about route building? Have you tried route building? If you wish to go to a dungeon or another city in this world, you will have cre have create have to F12. Does anybody spell check or grammar check these things? You will have to create a path by using route building. God damn. You need credits to use route building, so manage your spending carefully. Oh, spend all my money. Didn't I get a plan? Oh, power bracelet. Wait, very slow. The strange sense of power flowing from it. I almost feel like I could just break stuff in the dungeon. Ooh, is this what I used to uh break the boxes? Well, rip my money.
got super rare item trophy earned. That's super rare, really? It was super easy to make, though. Destructible objects. Aha! You will sometimes encounter obstacles within dungeons. These obstacles are known as destructible objects, and you can destroy them when you possess the power bracelet. When you break destructible objects, you can you may obtain a random item. Try to destroy these objects when you can. Now we can break shit. As the game progresses, you may obtain an item that is even more powerful than a power bracelet. Ooh. Cool. I wonder if I need to equip it. Looks like a key item, so probably not. I don't have enough of the things. Gotta go get the things so we can make the stuff. Nothing new here. We're done there. Please select a place to build a route to. I want to go to a lean box. Let's go. Oh, it's all sparkly over there. I don't need any credits for the first one. First gen CPU sanctuary, huh? Slice through trophy earned! We're just getting trophies now, huh? Let's do it. There are no more places to build to. Bad. Let's try going here. Wow! So this is the sacred land of plant planetunes. First CPU that Vert was talking about. Wait, 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 wait. I did call this. So this is the sacred land of Planet Tunes first CPU that Ver was talking about. There we go, there we go. From what I can see, it doesn't seem different from any other dungeon. Ah, oh, whatever. I have to worry about fixing Isti first. Oh, wait. I just thought of something. I haven't saved in like five years. I should definitely save. And a new slot since we're in a new area. What if I died? I'd have to redo all that stuff. Dogus! Now this dungeon looks pretty fucking familiar. I'm for enemy dogus. You guys do no damage. Oh, you do ba you do barely any damage. Yeah, it's laid out the same as previous games too. Tell are you. Lou Choco P. Hmm. What could this be a reference to? I am. I don't know. Bird Choco. I don't know. It's, who knows? Nobody knows. You actually do damage. Order up. Total victory. Oh, what the fuck's this? Oh, it's a warp point. I can already jump high enough to jump on top. That means your base jump is higher in this one, right? Boing! Boing! Ah, rip.
Oka P's beak. Oka. I just ripped off their beak. That seems kind of rude, you know? Hi guys, what are you guys doing all the way up here? Hey, get any of you. What the hell did you say? Oh. You wanna be starting something? Oh. You wanna be starting something? Oh, nephew, all up. Delinquent cat? Chloe, you got delinquents here. What's going on? You wanna be starting something? You asshole. What? Wow, I can't believe they said that. What the hell? Ooh. Damn. You guys are rude. I haven't done this yet. doesn't really seem to do a whole lot more damage. Can I even use formation skill by myself? Probably not. I'm gonna die. I'm seriously gonna die. You're not gonna die. I've got lots of healing items for you. Oh, this is the other side over there. Yeah, this would require people, right? Need to raise. I wouldn't be able to do any formation skills right now. Yeah, I am late for snacky break, aren't I? Hee hee hee. I've been having too much fun killing things. Oh, what's this? I've been waiting. Rabbi. I do some damage. Here's where a lot of those boxes were hidden in the dungeons in the last game. I don't seem to have the hidden boxes in this one, though. Not a thing. 
That's a lot of treasure, I'm suspicious. Blink the cats might kill me if I don't heal. Freddy's. I know, right? Right rabbit tail. Nothing can kill me here, right? I'm safe here. I just realized I'm like 20 minutes late for snacky break. Ugh. I take snackle break. Now you can hear Neptune say cool stuff the whole break. Be like, nap, 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 It'll be exciting. It's like some of the enemies are respawning. I wonder if there's anything cool in here. Ooh, they respawn quicker than I thought they would. Oh, maybe that's just maybe they respawn quicker in this world, but not the other one. Hmm. Maybe. Regardless, I'm gonna go take my snack over break. It's something tasty. That tone will keep you company. It'll keep you company. Hello. Ooh, cool. Say, she'll keep you company. B R B. Let's go beat up some monsters. This right here, very cool. Kill it. Start to finish. I'm always at the climax. It's all over. I'll mess you all up. Did it hit me? Order up. In a game too, just playing it real bad. Oh, Boing. oh, you got this. Ooh, this might be tougher.
pretty bad. I wonder what's inside. Solo napping. Yeah, I'm all by myself. Where did my teammates go? They're back in the other dimension. Compa fighting the big syringe. Yeah! Maybe we'll get her back and we can syringe people again. To be fair, if someone was coming at you with a giant syringe, you'd be terrified too, wouldn't you? Imagine being a mob and Compa saying it's time for your meds. Exactly. Terrifying. Where'd this go? Ah, man. Can't go back. Quite rude. You got like one HP.
Hmm. I keep forgetting to go behind them. But they're doing that to me, so I should be doing that to them. We stop resonating with the doggos. The ones in this world, though, are enemies. I believe the mobs are actually talking. Yeah, this is the first game where the mobs talk and it's kind of, it's kind of weird. Right? I like, uh, what? This seems like the deepest part of the dungeon, but I haven't found anything. There aren't any treasure boxes or graves or nothing. Going off of the usual Neptunia plot progression, a boss monster will appear and may and I'd get an item from defeating it. Maybe. Yikes! Was my prediction that spot on? You did it to yourself, Neptune. You jinxed it. Well, if it is, at least I know the item's gonna drop as soon as I knock that thing out. I won't hold back. Prepare yourself. I mean, yeah, she's already in the, in the front, yes. So, like, she, she's good. So, you're my opponent? To you guys. Let's get fired up. Well, let us fight. Uh -huh. It'd be kind of hard to get behind him. Very. You missed. do anything of that. I only got the three person one. My critical edge will tear you apart. You're finished. My teeth are sold. This is I'm nothing. going to cut you to pieces. It is very weird. What's the point of this circle thing? That's where I need to be to hit it, I think. Excuse me. He got a super ability. Good thing I just saved. Oh wow, game over. And they were never heard from again. 
Rest in peace. Mega Dimension Neptunia! Me too! It's just kind of brutal being by yourself. You can only use items to heal because you don't have a heal. No, oh, I didn't start off at uh, max HP. Oops. I know I have to keep my HP up in case he does the other thing. Who's my opponent? Combination. Now he's not using it. Really weird. This one. There we go. Uh, ouch. Let's end this. This one. This is quite a One HP. Get out of here. Who's next? Why would you regret nothing? He didn't drop anything. I've grown a step yet again. Woohoo! It looks like my shares have fallen quite a bit. But it was a good handicap against this level of a monster. Let's see now. Where is that Sanshiro Soulful Patch? What's this? There's a hole in the ground? 
Was there one here before? Well, whatever. I'll try digging it up. I think I found something. This is an iron box, isn't it? Maybe the item's here. Let's crack this thing open. What's inside? It's a bunch of old cartridges. Whoa, these are all super nostalgic. Rogo 13 game, Wonderful Boy, Orgus, and there's even Load Gunner. I can't believe so many archaeological retro games were buried here. Maybe they were the first CPU's mementos? So if I search carefully, maybe... I found it! Soulful is handwritten on it. So this has got to be the cassette. Uh, it's not, it's not going to work. Gotta go. Gotta blow on it. Obtain an item. Sonsero's Soulful Patch. Whoa, how convenient. I got what I came for. I better hurry on home. Wow. I choose you. I'll mess you all up. Deal with things. It's all over. Woohoo! You thought you could stop me, you cute bluebird? No. Really? I only got one dog of jelly. Seriously? I choose you. They're coming from above. Watch out. We're not able to see Sagatha. So sad. Full speed ahead. Figured out the button on the skip. It was L1 in previous games. And this one's L2. Maybe the Dwagon was Sagatha all along. <gasps> Maybe. Are they really not giving me any doggo jelly? Why not? Why do they have such a low drop rate? Hmm. Their monster info? Previous games had monster info. Hmm. Oh, enemy info. Hmm. 
Yeah, it drops dog goo jelly. Not doing a good job of dropping it. Give me my doggo jala. There, there. What is the drop rate? Five percent. Oh, there we go. I'd be able to make uh, the nep bowl now. Oh, no way. I needed four. I thought I needed two. Rip. Why is the drop rate so garbage? I just remember having to fight a lot of certain mobs. Or a few, for a few, you're done drop to craft certain things for a mission. It sounds exciting. There you. Uh, can't we just hang out here? Let's go. Me, my jelly, you bitches. How dare you? This is illegal. The drop right so terrible for him. Oh, hi, guys. I'm gonna kill you in one shot now because I leveled up like two levels. Get wrecked, guys. Get wrecked. There's a Jella. Yo, I'm up for speed up the game. Yeah, you hold L2. In the previous games, it was L1, so I wasn't sure if you could skip, but I tried pressing L2 and it worked. And you hold L2 and it just goes. Pshow. Yeah, if you don't hold L2, it does the, the, the moves. Of course you didn't drop me anything. There you go. Now we should have enough. More dogos. But they drop jelly. Uh, can't we just hang out here? All right. We can get to Nipple Blues. Well, now it should be able to be made in the shop, right? Didn't get enough crude circuits for that one. I was back in the other area, though. I am seeing nine of those.
Was it alright to leave things to nap? I'm worried. You should be worried. I'm home. How's Isty doing? Oh my god, a voice acted scene. Welcome home, Nep Nep. Isty's still passed out. No new developments here. How'd it go, Nep? Did you find the item? Ta da! You better believe it. Wow, you're amazing, Nep Nep. I knew you could do it if you tried. You just gotta make sure to thank the other CPUs after this is over, all right? They helped you out even when things got really rough out there, after all. Yeah, I know it. I wouldn't have been able to do it without them, so I'm gonna treat them all to something nice when it's all over. All right, so where's the item you brought? Can you hand it over, please? I wanna hurry and install it in Eastwar. But how are we supposed to insert this weird cassette thing into Isti? She has a slot somewhere. Maybe somewhere on her back? I just looked all over her, but I didn't see any slot that was shaped like that. Did you now? Did that thing come with an instruction manual? Nope, none. Well, that's no good. Even when we have the solution to her problem, we can't even get it to work. I know. How about sticking this cassette in Isti's mouth? What? I think that might be a little bit of a stretch. Let's keep looking for another way. It's completely fine. Isti's tough. She can handle it. Here we go. Now, we're all prepped and ready to go. Drop Sandra Silver Patch. We can't show this face to anyone. Starting automatic program. Checking update patch. Beginning installation. I can't believe it's actually installing this way. It's kind of an insane design. <laughs> Maybe the CPU from back then had a similar personality to old Nepnep -Nep over here. So, how long do you think it'll take for the patch to install? It's unclear. We'll just have to believe in Isti and wait for her to recover. Ah, uh, you're right. We'll put all our faith in Isti then. I hope she gets better soon. Whoa! Nap Station! It's been a while since my program's aired. You're here live today with hosts Neptune and... Noir, also known as the CPU of Last Station. Ooh, as expected of Noir, you always introduce yourself so darn properly. What's with that? Introducing myself properly? How were you guys doing it until now? Well, I mean, those playing this game know us pretty well already, so like, you know, whatever, it's cool. <sighs> I can't believe you. There are always newcomers, so you should always explain things for everyone. I've thought about this for a while, but since we're here, I'll say it clearly. If you, as the protagonist, act like this, new players who've taken an interest are going to get left behind. This isn't the kind of playful banter you'd hear backstage on talk shows. So you have to explain properly. In the first place, your self-awareness as the face of this series is... Stop, stop, stop! What is this? New... Wait. New ba ma fu? What? Huh? This isn't a freaking public channel, you weirdo. This is specialized entertainment. I listen to your lecturing after hours all the time, so just ease up during the show. Jeez. Oh, even I can't put up with this. Pudding! Someone bring me a pudding stat! Very well. Then after this is over, let's have a long talk with Eastwar included. Ugh. Now that Neptune has a deathly pallor on her face, let's move on to the episode preview. Stop it! If our four special ability burns up Nepgear's share crystals, her mind will burn up as well. Please don't die, Nepgear. 
If you fall here, what will happen to your promise with Uzume and Umio? You still have some share energy left. If you just make it through this, you can win against R4. Next episode, Nepgear dies. Dimension ready. Ah! Spoilers in an episode preview. Amateurs. Well then, see you next time. Bye bye. Somehow I think Nepgear's fine. You damn idiot! Do you understand the implications of what you just did? But the way things were going, you would have... I ain't having it! It was your chance to go home! We worked so hard and you just friggin' blew it! Uzume, nothing can be done about that now. What's done is done. Please focus your energy on finding a means of escaping. We'll talk about this later, Gearzy. Let's force our way through the front! Stay close, you two! Right. Nepgear is doing. Uzume is doing. Oh, we're gonna run. I'll rest for a bit. Oh, we got nepples unlocked over here too. We could get a crude circuit to do uh, the thingamajig. I'll work hard to become a fully fledged CPU. Which one drops the crude circuit? Probably somebody here. You guys, or you guys. Totally here. All right, I'm ready anytime. Leave to me. Nap is totally pretty. just goes, What's up? What's happening? How's it going? That's right, that's right. I did it! We won! Totally, totally. Here? Let's do our best. But we can break boxes now, too. Yeah. Oh, not those. Can't bear the voice bobs going Aah! But how are you supposed to laugh as they die? Did everyone see how I did? There you not drop one. There's a crude circuit. That was faster than I thought it was gonna be. Hee 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 
Now we can buy the exciting. I think we're in the clear. Okay, Gearzy, seriously, what the hell was that? Well, you were in danger, Uzume. My body just kind of moved on its own. And before I knew it, I was jumping out of the turf. None of that matters. I shouldn't even have been part of that equation. This was your chance. What are you doing wasting it on me? So stupid. It, it wasn't stupid. And it wasn't a waste. You're still here and you're safe. And that's what matters to me, okay? If I have to sacrifice someone to get home, then it's not worth it to me. I'm sure Big Sis would say the exact same thing. But then... But then, how can I ever forgive myself for ruining your only way home? Uzume, it's in the past. What's important now is to begin planning our next move. That's easy. We're going right back over there and wrecking each and every last one of them. Maybe Gearzy can still make it back home. If that was a good plan, you wouldn't have run away to begin with. Even if we returned there, if the terminal was heavily beaten in the battle, I doubt it's usable any longer. Then what are we supposed to do? Our current foe differs from the giant in that she has clear objectives when mounting her attack. I propose we evacuate this area completely. You really want us to run away from her? Not exactly. We'll need to devise an appropriate strategy of retaliation, considering this foe is so different from what we faced in the past. Concurrently, we can also be considering alternative options to return Gearzy home. Okay, as long as we get to fight back. I hate being passive. It doesn't feel right. Understood. Let us return to our main base. Some of our friends may be able to offer help. I'm sorry to interrupt, but what do you mean by main base, Uzume? Wasn't this your base? I guess I never mentioned it. This was just a temporary base we created for our bouts with the giant. And don't think asking me questions is gonna make me forget your foolish move. You're in for a long lecture once we get over there, Gearzy. <laughs> Please go easy on me. No. Uzume! Who's me? Going here? I don't have to do any bridge building in this world. Daytona cave? Not Daytona, it's Daytona. This cave is your main base? I think I can hear monsters. Nah, this isn't it. What is this place, Umio? It's a shortcut I found not too long ago. We run less of a risk of being spotted traveling through here than walking outside. There are monsters inside, but... Well, I'm sure you two can handle it. Well, well. I wondered where these, where they were heading, but it looks as if these rats are voluntarily heading into our trap. Uh-oh. Then, as you fools so desire, I will kill you, slowly and painfully. 
Uh-oh. We're, we're in trouble now. Ah, oh, I've seen this is dungeon design before. I've seen this before! Ooh, are you not a super tough enemy this time? You just a nor you're a normal guy now. I'll end this all. Can you use the skill things with two people? I think I need three, right? Yeah, so we can't do the formation thing, uh. Three. Can I target more than one at a time? Look at that. Doesn't look like it. B. I'm trying to sound like a machine going, but it uh doesn't come across as very robotic shouting, does it? Her robot sounds have never been very robotic. I always just sound like some dude saying, doing robot sounds. Get both. Dark. You're ten years too early. Don't underestimate me. To the chest. It's kind of painful. Sorry. I'm a mess. 
behemoth claws. They're imitating robot sounds to look like robots. There we go. He's at our limit. That's not good. I got bunny. Maybe. Now, who to choose? Don't underestimate me! To the chest! I'm fine. Target confirmed. Too weak. It's my turn! Oh, you can't go missing. I'm a mess. Oh. Heal me. I refuse. I'm just kidding. I'll heal you. Hey, Garzy. I'm a little late in asking, but didn't you forget to bring your end gear? You didn't forget to bring your end gear, did you? I have it right here. It's my most important possession next to my life, so I made sure to bring it. Huh? What's wrong? Um, it won't be- t it won't turn on. It might be because I yanked out the cable pretty hard while escaping. Did it get broken? Maybe I could give it a whack for ya? Whack it? You wanna hit the end gear? You know, it's like when you whack a TV and it gets fixed, right? I hit my radio too, when it acts up. Although, since it's getting old, even if I whack it, it doesn't help. I think that hitting it is just, just making the damage even worse. What? Really? I think so. Since I have the chance, I can fix it once we get to the base. I also have to figure out why the end gear isn't working also. Could you maybe modify my visual radio to be all cool like yours? You could add some awesome functions to it. Oh, that's a good idea. Is there any function you would like me to add? Hmm, now that you ask, I can't think of nothing. Well, we have some time. Give it some thought before we, we reach your base. Will do. I had thought the two would be depressed, but it looks as if I was needlessly worried. I let my guard down? Ugh, not bad. I'll be serious. How dare you? Don't 
Why do we get two turns before he even attacks? How's that? Was it cool? Hey, Desk Ronda. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Get the uh, 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 not hold back at all. And gear. This is just the name of the equipment. What crazy thing are you thinking? I can't believe this. I don't want observation scopes. What heals? You're surrounded. I'll be serious. My turn. Don't underestimate me. You're so damn lame. You're not half bad. What should I do? Hanging up on her. Eight hundred damage. Jeez. Can't reach him, really. Dance. I did it. <sighs> I managed somehow. Somehow, some way. That way. Yeah. 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 I'll beat you to a bloody pulp. It's my turn. I will back down. Mirage yeah. I'm a force of fury. Don't underestimate me. Grave your burden. Two HP. Got two HP. To the chest. You're ten years too early. I'll heal you. Thanks. Maybe I should heal. Here, heal up. Target confirmed. Just a scratch. It's kind of painful. I'll heal you. I'll end this all. To the it's my turn. Yeah. Uh, I did it. Your SP skills are pretty OP. It feels like the regular skills are not. Oh, I should have just bought like 30 SP chargers and. Cry saber. Yo, I need to heal soon. I can't believe you don't get your HP and SP re refilled when you level up. That's crazy. Pretty sure that's different from all the other games. In uh, most RPGs, you re refill your HP and MP or whatever. Very intriguing. Yeah. Wouldn't it try something? Try Sable. Hmm. We'll refill per level up. Nope. This probably goes back. Yeah, because it does that in the previous. Uh... Uh, I'm okay. I can keep going. You're not okay. Let's do our best, everyone. Oh, I 
Leave this to me. I'm a force of fury. Bring your burden. What should I do? I'll end this all. Bring your burden. Yeah. Looks like we win this match. I'll beat you to a bloody pulp. Leave this to me. I'll end this all. Bring your burden. You're so damn lame. You just not do much damage to him. Jeez, all I'm doing is with her is heal. I'll end this all. You lie. You lived through that. Come on. We got, we got the... Uh... The game's definitely feeling tougher early game than the last one. Rebirth 3 felt really easy by comparison. Let's go. This one definitely feels tougher. Must be charges are expensive. Plus fifteen. This looks freaking cool, right? Right. We don't need any mana. Money's option manals. The name's Uzume Tanoboshi. Yeah, it's pretty badass. I know. Cringe. And gear skill goes like boo and throws a wave out of nowhere. Hee 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 hee. Could you heal me? 
Shut up, you bitch. How dare you. I'm just making sure you guys got the best stuff on. It feels like I'm under leveled. They hit pretty hard, so it feels like I'm under leveled. Goodbye, guys. Mission failed. Could use more levels. I'll beat you to a bloody pot. What should I do? I'm a force of fury. To the chest. You're not happy. Serious. My turn. You're not half bad. What should I do? I'm a force of fury. Don't underestimate me. Leave this to me. I'll end this all. Here, heal up. Don't. It's kind of painful. Imagine the BA of the mobs beat themselves up to make those mob voice lines. Oh, they just say something like, uh, you just got killed, and they'd be like, Wah! They don't have to actually beat themselves up for it. Come on. That's right, this is pathetic. You can do better than this. Yay! If I were killing you guys for some XP. I don't like the ro robot guys. Uh. Rock resistant plate metal plate. Cool. I'm sure those are required for plants. Sorry, could you heal me? Heal yourself, bitch. You got heals. Do it yourself. Oh. I got was on over there. I wonder why they decided to give him voices. Some of them even speak English it's, instead of just being like, wah, wah. The other games that just made noises. Well, some of them talk. It's like, what? Yeah. I'm too lazy to fight you guys. Not bad. Don't me. 
I'm too strong. They survived. Show you how cool I am when I'm fully healed, you know? You can? Nothing a little sick couldn't fix. Achoo. What efficiency matters is. I'm gonna have no trouble getting to that. Oh, it's complete. Efficiency matters is done. Combo trench! Are the events over there? Jump. Let's see what's over here. I'll beat you to a bloody pulp. My turn. Oh, I forgot the healer. My turn. Here, heal up. Not bad. Don't. Leave this to me. Oh, yeah. Here, heal up. Don't. I'll heal you. It's not fast. There it is to me. Not about right. This is why Napcare went and got Uzumai. He keeps dying. That's why. This may have absolutely died if we hadn't abandoned the transporter. 100%.
myself hello oh, no, when did you yeah she doesn't have any elemental attacks I found an item I output megaphone alpha this much is nothing Plus 58 strength. Ooh. Nice taste. Let's do it. Maybe she'll be better than Nepgear. Right now she's been holding Nepgear back. Huh? A scrap? Yeah. It's our chance to attack together. Oh right, it has di it's a new weapon, so it'll have different combos. We have to check that. Did everyone see how I did? Yo, I need to heal soon. Shut up. Oh, it's for rush. Hmm. It's not gonna help, but... Not the best uh, combos. Oh well. A lot of dudes. I'm a force of fury. Targets confirmed. I'll be serious. Just a scratch. Targets confirmed. Just a scratch. Targets confirmed. Too weak. Now, who to choose? Wave your burden. I'll be serious. Just a scratch. Oop, she did. I'll use this. 
Targets confirmed. Targets confirmed. Targets confirmed. Eh, yeah, maybe. Oh, two of them live? I thought there was only gonna be one left after that. How oh, dare they? How oh, dare they? Large fang for my trouble. You better level up. Uh, I'm okay. I can keep going. Sure, 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 sure. Sure, 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 sure. Thank you for worrying about me. You're not welcome. What was that? When did I scratch myself? Oh, idea chips. Idea chips are back. Let's see. It means we that means discs will be back too. Aren't we there yet, Umio? This is most strange. It should have been straight along this path. Don't be alarmed, but it appears that we've lost our way. Let us retrace our steps. <laughs> Playtime is over, brats. Oh, you're that pop-up purple hag! I am not a pop-up purple hag! My name is R4, a name that will signal your demise and ring the bell of destruction for this hopeless world! This location does not exist on any map in existence. How do you know of this place? Simple. I took the liberty of following you fools who didn't have the sense to cover your tracks. Because of your stupidity, I was able to trap you all here in this dead end, so thank you. Whoa, like, gross! Being a stalker is like, so totally creepy! Ew! your speech last my deepest apologies to you both I should have known better this is my fault oh you don't gotta be sorry Umio we'll just have to crush her no sweat incoming fight I'm supposed to lose yeah Uzume's right we might be cornered but we don't have a super huge horde of monsters to fight here we can do it a cornered animal has nothing to lose. We'll get in her face and rip her stupid grin to shreds. You won't even recognize her when we're done. You too. R4, prepare yourself! Your life will end here! What? What did you say just now? Huh? Um, I said... R4, prepare yourself! Your life will end here! Just the first part. Just say the first part one more time. The first... you mean, just say your name? R4? One more time, with some respect. Miss R4? Oh... <laughs> okay. Since first I appeared, it's been R snore this, R bore that, or pop up purple hag, the worst. Finally. Finally, you called me by my name! Ah, <laughs> I guess she was actually pretty bothered by our name calling. Hey, R4, since I called you by name, you'll let us pass by you now, right? No. 
What's up? What's happening? How's it going, Gina? How you doing tonight? Of course. You are one of the few. No, the only one who's ever used my name. That is an effortless request to fulfill. Wait, really? Yay! Thank you so much! Idiot. You really expected me to do that? Aw, oh, darn. I knew it. Show's over. We'll just make our way by force. Looks like you're alone, too. We're gonna make you regret not bringing reinforcements. Gearsy, let's get serious. You got it. <laughs> Will you stop prancing around like the weaklings I know that you are? I alone am enough for you, twerps. Prepare to die. Uh oh. Uzi needs a CPU too. Ruin to all. I won't hold back. Ah, uh, bash. Didn't even have the decency to give me full HP and SP. Like seriously. Keeps going away so that uh, that gear can't reach her. Mostly focusing on her. Maybe I should just defend her. Going for her. I guess we have to do this. Can't I just defend? Heal her all day. See what that does. Of the 
apocalypse is now. Being too far away to do anything with Nepgear. He's running away. I think you never noticed the R4 bottle is not just random mobs or a giant bot girl. What? Orange one making slot machine noises? Excuse me. Those are probably her roller skates you're hearing. She's got roller skates. Oh my gosh, you finally attacked Nepgear for the first time. Hundred percent a gotcha slot machine CPU. Pretty sure she's based off the Dreamcast. And so at the beginning of the game, they go get sucked into a portal into this dimension where Uzume is by pressing the power button on what looks like a Dreamcast. You totally Dreamcast lady. Of course she has a big bad move. Heal again, then. What? You're not gonna go for the big thing. I'm gonna do a cool move. PSP charger plan. I mean, so we can make SP item. We can buy from shop. I feel power overflowing. I bet you do. I think I saw this level up in a dream. Okay, sure. 
Scream Smash Fist Acquired. Whoa. Super repeat waves. Whoa. Not bad. You're way too strong for a lowly pop-up hag, but it's not enough. We nab this victory. <laughs> what delusions are you living in? I've barely used half of my strength. <laughs> Kuzume won't fall for that. Your ignorance will cost you. It's time for you to learn your place the hard way. My true form and my true power! Hello, oh, no. this one looks familiar. That form! Why are you in that form? Ew! Gross! Kirzy, I don't think I want to fight her anymore! It'll be so gross to touch her! What? Did you really just say that? cute when you're in a panic, Gearzy. Goodness. Joking around at a time like this is bad for my poor heart. Oh, you girls think this is a time for jokes? Very well then, suit yourself. Die! Uh-oh. Mad. This is it, Gearzy. I'm sorry. Ah! It sounds like Neptune. Wait, that voice. Is that? What is it, Gearzy? I thought I just heard Neptune's voice. Nepsy's voice? I mean, I guess she could have done all the things on the other side and come back here now. Maybe we'll flash back and see it. <laughs> Don't think I'll fall for such an obvious time-wasting bluff. I will end you! Move, move, move! I'm gonna crash! Uh-oh. Huh? <laughs> so much smoke! What? What fell? Were those losers really able to call for reinforcements? Oh, man. I really took a tumble there. Shoot, I was so close to finally catching a skyfish. Who are you? I didn't realize the ground was missing there. I should have long hair now. It's a good thing the body is resilient enough to keep working, even after taking a fall from such tall heights. It's because you're not human. Those are here, but you'd be toast. What? Oh, it's the people who were down below. Hey, you guys hurt? Everyone okay? <laughs> who are you? Me? My name's Neptune. I guess she's this dimension's Neptune. She's clearly older, too. Taller, more uh, um, developed, <coughs> longer hair. This is as if Neptune had aged longer before she became a CP. This is what she'd look like. Ugh. There's multiple that. I don't know if we can, the world can handle multiple Neptunes, man. That mean there's another nep gear around too. Ooh. To be honest, I'm a bug hunter who explores other dimensions. I just happen to be passing by. What? Uh... Whoops! Looks like you all were in the middle of something. Sorry for interrupting you. Uh... Hmm. I think I get what's going on here. 
Considering I'm an ally to all cute girls, I'm gonna be helping you with your situation here. Uh, um... Hey, cutie, with the pink hair, what's your name? Me? Yep, you. My name is Nepgear. Wow, you have Nep in your name too? Crazy! This Nep can't help but feel like there is some kind of sentimental fate at play here. Hey! Stop ignoring me! Hey, hey, Umio! What's going on? Nepsy left, grew up super fast, and then fell on us! Even I cannot begin to understand this. But if she's willing to help us, her presence will be quite appreciated. Hey! Oh? Are you guys Nepgear's friends? That thing on your wrist is really cool. <laughs> Let me see it. Cool? <laughs> if you can understand the level of cool my radio wields, then even in your adult state, you're pretty smart, Nepsy. Hey! Nepsy, now is not the time for... Wait, what's this fish? <laughs> That's hilarious! Look at his serious mug! I said hey! Yikes, the weirdo lady just lost it. Cease your pointless babbling! How dare you creatures ignore me! Oh, sorry. Did you want us to include you in our conversation? Because... no. I think I'll pass on including a terrible person who torments cute girls. Plus, uh, no offense, but you look kind of creepy. <sighs> Running your mouth like that? I, R4, will have you pay for making a mockery of me! You will pay with your life. Arbor? <laughs> what a weird name! Uh-uh. -oh. The puddings did work. Oh yeah, the puddings worked all right. It's not R4. It's R4. R4. Now well, maybe if you stop sounding so echoey, she could hear you properly. R Fjord? <laughs> Why do they call you that? I seriously doubt anyone sailed up that inlet in over a millennia. <laughs> I'd blame your wardrobe. Wow! Whoa! Damn! That's so me! Why you? Wow! Nepsy's amazing! No one comes close to her in riling up Grandma Arfie over there! I think the bigger problem is that R4 is just unable to cope with being instigated. Never forgive you. I'll murder all four of you at once. Oh, hold up. Quick time out. Huh? It's RPG tradition to heal up before battle. Today, as a special present, I'll give you girls the Netball V2 that I just made. It, it's a totally crazy color. But is it all right? They say bitter medicine's the best, so a little bitterness is kind of fun. Go ahead, slam it down like milk after a nice hot bath. All in one go. Do it! Okay. Ugh, it's really bitter. But, wow, my wounds are healing. I think my strength's coming back too. We can probably win against her now. Now, let's get pumped up for the boss battle. Neptune is joined! I won't hold back! The time of the apocalypse is won't hold now. Back. No, bah. Here we go again. There was no save before all this either.
Steal an item from the enemy? What? What? That sounds funny. Do it. No item? God damn it. I didn't think so. You missed both your shits. Stop missing! All right, I'll go calmly. Put this out. The time of the apocalypse Stop. is oh, now. right. Into the specimen. Spiral dream. Not bad. I no longer have doubt. Let's mix things up. Ruin to all. Yeah. Spiral dream. I'll be able to, since I have three, I can do the formations too. I just remembered. Well, maybe not. She might not be able to do it. Oh, she might not count. Okay. Yeah, she doesn't count for this fight. But I just got a challenge completed with her, so she's obviously going to join the party. Damn. He had a defense up, too. You know, when someone shows up, they're supposed to be super tough and badass, right? Power up with my nutness. I guess we have to do this. Yeah. Yeah. Put this out. Ruin to all. No, shut up. Uzumi's turn. Not bad. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Into the specimen book. Yeah. All right. I'll go call you. You missed. This is the essence of dual wielding. Not bad. Yeah. I guess we have to do this. Not bad. Yeah. Spiral dream. Not bad. The time of the apocalypse Stop. is now. Finally. I no longer have doubt. Let's 
shall go forth. <laughs> power up with my neck nose. Ouch! My it's Ugami's turn. Here's a heal. All right, I'll go calmly. Into the specimen book. Will I be defeated? That's the new one you just got. His male punch you with a share energy shaped into a drill. Damn. Will I be yeah. I won't hold back. Not I can do this too. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I am defeated. Yep. Ugh, so tired. Look at me the mess. Discard. Ooh, our first disc. Ice Edge. Ooh. Up. Super giant breaking waves. Ooh, I've gotten stronger. Oh, level up. Before victory. Impossible. How could I be defeated by these foolish children? Believe it. You're done. Hey, are you two CPUs, perchance? Definitely. Sorry for the late intro, but I'm Uzume, and I'm the CPU of this nation. Thanks a lot for the help. We really needed it. Ooh, even in your normal form, you're pretty cool looking. You think I'm cool looking? Ha! I knew you'd get my vibe, Nepsy! You know, in your normal state, Nepgear, your looks are pretty similar to mine. Not really, but okay. If I ever had a younger sister, she might even look like you. Oh, what a pretty thought. I'd love to have a younger sister someday. Uh, um... I know, right? It's like, excuse me. Now, now, Nepsy. You're troubling Gearsy. Oops, sorry, Gearsy. I didn't mean to trouble you. I just got excited. Oh, that's right. What do we do with this grotesque lady? Arbor, was it? What should we do? I didn't really think of what to do with her after she'd been defeated. We hadn't really expected the tables to turn in our favor like that, but now we have the perfect opportunity to beat some sense into her. <laughs> Now then, what to do? I'm gonna punish you in my own super stylish way, so I hope you're prepared. I mean, a lot, our four from last game got punished a lot too by a certain Iris Heart. Uh, I no longer have any will to fight you. Aren't you a CPU? As a CPU, you should treat prisoners according to the law. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like I give a crap. I'm the CPU of this nation, and that means I am the law. Whatever I do is the frickin' law. Even if I beat you to a bloody dead pulp, as long as it's cool in my book, that's all that matters, right? Huh? Answer me! Violence is not the answer! You were just trying to kill us! Usume's really getting into it, huh? She's acting like a nasty delinquent. This isn't unexpected. There has been a startling amount of rage welling inside of her. She's turning into quite the villain. Hey, hold your horses. Violence is no good. What? You, you're going to save me? Step aside, Big Nepsy. I have no obligation to this monster, and she's not getting out alive. It's a bad move, Uzume. 
Anyway, I've decided to put this gross bug into my specimen book, so you can't. What? I mean, come on! Check out those purple wings! She's like some kind of poisonous butterfly, so she's gotta be a rare creature! So, I'm gonna put her into my specimen book alive and make her part of my collection! What? Ah! Well, she is the most vile creature here. Exactly! Well, that's the deal, so it's absorption time! Let's go! Shrinking and getting absorbed by that crazy book! Last but not least, I just tape her down and voila! It's finished! Uh, okay. Huh, that's a pretty dope book if it can turn that hulking beast into a stupid little bug. What is the meaning of this? Who do you fools think I am? Release me this instant! I think she's saying something. Hey, if the book ends up so thick, won't you be unable to fully close it? Hey, don't you dare ignore me! Oh, no worries about that. There. Whoa, you squished her! Oh, no, no, she's totally fine. I don't really get it, but if I close the book, I can preserve her as is. It's super convenient. This is so weird, but really freaking awesome. At the very least, it will reduce the burden of carrying her around. And we can speak to her at our leisure afterwards. I'd still like to get a few punches in, though. Sure. But let's keep moving back to the base for now. Right. You gonna tag along, Big Nepsy? Is that okay with everyone? Of course. You saved us, after all. I'd really like to thank you somehow. Yippee! <laughs> I've been kind of bummed out since I got here. It's been super lonely without anyone around. Plus, I've run out of food, so I've been on the brink of starvation for a little while. Oh, no! We'll make sure you get fed. The least we could do. Really? Thanks so much. Let us depart, then. We may speak at length once we arrive at our destination. Wow, I mean... Maybe I'm pushing myself too hard. I mean, speak at length, sure, except it's like... Way past bedtime. We just had lots of cutscenes to do. Hmm, that's not gonna help me. Those two will help me. That one's not helping because none of those use combo tricks. <laughs> Damn it. They dual wield them. Got through that dungeon, we beat up our boar twice. I wasn't expecting to happen. We beat it. We did it. We got to the end of this stream. It's definitely time for sleepos. It turned our 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 our, 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 our boar became an our burger. Oh, oh, squish! Oh wait, she's fine. No video games for today though. You had an exciting time. Hmm, it just saved, so we're all good. 
That was cool. They lost all progress. Next time they'll talk for about five hours about whatever the heck's going on. And she's got a uh, up here that just pops to bitches, apparently. I need to have her meet the the other one. And just be like, Wow, now there's two! What the heck? That's fun. Oh, I'm glad you had fun. I had fun too. It's a good pun. I don't know what breaker is. Let's see. X drive to breaker level one. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's the part breaking thing, right? Uh. I guess so. Specimen book. Oh my gosh. Can we see her specimen book? I don't think so. Let's see what she's caught so far. Oh, wait, like at uh, the end of the last game, there was an ending where the fairy, I forgot what her name was, Dark East Talar, went to another dimension, then uh, something showed up and grabbed her or whatever. I bet it was Neptune here. I bet that fairy, whatever her name was, is in the book. Very exciting. Maybe we'll find out next time. We'll find out next time. Oh, thank you for the bitters. I'm not sure how to pronounce your name, though. Zixri? I'm not sure. We're just calling you Z. Hello! What's up, Tapna? How's it going? You're just in time, though, for me to go to sleep. Call you Airzel. Oh, okay. We just beat up R4. Your supporter, VTuber. Oh, that's cool. We just beat up R4 twice and got... Older Neptune in our party. Very exciting. I'm way past bedtime though. There was that was a big long cutscene going through that dungeon and fighting the boss twice and stuff. Next time we'll be going over there and talking a bunch, I'm sure. Maybe I'm pushing myself too hard. Or it be tubers like yourself. Oh, that's cool. Thanks for stopping by, giving the bitas. Putting Neptune. That's right, that's right. Courtney Besties the greatest. That's right, that's right. That's right. Models cute. Aw, oh, thank you. Uh, 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 we're super cute. We're super cute. Wee! We're super dope, are cute, okay? Thanks for stopping by, though. It's time for us to sleep, though. Where was my cat thing? This is that video games for today. It's time for sleep. It's time for Z Z Z's. Good night. Sleep tight. No bad bugs. All that good stuff. You just had you yesterday with the score again. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. A great sense of humor. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you for the other hundred bit tasks. Tackle, tackle, tackle. I scrolled up in chat and then I got bigger. I got bigger. I got smaller. Oh, <laughs> another hip hopping, bopping, popping stream. It was very cool. Good night, G Dog. Good night, Cat. Good night, Airs Though. Good night, uh. Who did we have earlier? Guru, Mexican Boy King, Enigma Pyro. Labor. Everybody stop by tonight. Fox lurkers, everybody. You all take care of yourselves, okay? You have a good night. Whoosh. I'm gonna get my sleep. Thanks for stream for feel. Thanks for hanging out, cat. Profile night. There we go. Profile night. Profile sleep. And sleepy time. 